Ben! Top. <laughs> Ben's having uh, some audio issues at the moment. Yeah, I... Uh, top. This. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, man, how you doing? Yeah, I'm all right. Um... What's the news? What What's is the news? What is new in Benland? I don't know. Started painting up those planes for planes. Aeronautica. Pew pew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I've sprayed them and I've inked them. So, Pow. you know, I'm 90% of the way there. Yeah, holy shit. <laughs> Just going to uh, give it a bit of a dry brush and pick out some details. And then I'm ready for Plane Wars. Pew pew pew. Plane Wars. Um, yeah, I've not, I've not built mine. What? I know. You're the one that... I didn't even, wasn't even up for this. You yeah, were like, fuck. Ben, I really want to play Plane Wars. And I was oh, like, I really Tom, want to play more for you, and I will paint some planes. Uh, yeah, just haven't fucking, haven't fucking done it. But I will. I'll get it sorted out. Maybe we can play yeah. next week. Um, Fair enough. But yeah. That's the Finished XCOM last week. Holy shit. That was a big one. Saved the world. Did you? I did. Pretty good. Pretty cool. Pretty much single-handed. Yeah. Um, wow. Wow, wow, wow. I mean, Lewis was there. He, his character wasn't in the final mission, and mine was. So. Oh, well... I feel like it's just Ben saved the world. <laughs> okay. Well, yeah, like, you know, Superman, he's off saving Metropolis, mm. and I'm sat here. Do I count as saving Metropolis? I don't no. think so. No, because I wasn't there. I wasn't well, because his character died ages ago. <laughs> oh, fuck. Well, yeah. So, yeah. Although, th then you're saying all the people who died, like, in World War II didn't help beat the Nazis. Well... They, then they kind of did. Well... <laughs> Do they still get participation ribbons? I don't know. I guess you uh, you do get um, awarded medals. Some people get like posthumous. You do. Medals, you do right? get posthumous medals. So maybe like Lewis can have a helped, help the world medal. Um, but he hasn't been given one yet. <laughs> <laughs> so it's in the post, along with the other like six hundred medals we have to give all our other fallen comrades. Oh, suddenly, that's a lot of medal work, <laughs> and they're not gonna know. We'll just say we did. We'll put it on their tombstones. Sure. Why not? How about Boom. that? Um, so, uh, exciting news. Mm -hmm. Marvel and Games Workshop team up. Oh. They're making Warhammer 40,000 and Age of Sigma comics. Marvel's going to start Ooh. making comics. Okay. Uh, Interesting. Because they've tried. Games Workshop's tried to make 40k comics before. The was never, that Inferno? Was that the yeah, it was like a, a spin-off. Inferno was like the short story compilation. Okay. Um, booklet. A couple of times they've tried to do a spin-off of that into comics, but they never did great, and they never were that good. Because they did the um, the Blood Angels. Yeah. Comics. I remember reading a couple of those. Um, uh, Death Death Squadron. Oh, yeah, Death Squadron. I read the those. Fighter Squadron. Recently went, and I found there was a website that just had just all of them. Oh, just, just scanned scroll in. through it as like just one <laughs> big image, and I reread those. They were great. Aww. They were honestly really entertaining. Um, the art style's great. Nice. Check it out if you like orcs and you like planes or Death either. Squadron. Um, it's very funny. Very Man, good. okay. Is it just going to be Space Marines or are they going to do some other things? No idea. Nothing's been announced yet. Well, they've said that it's going to be Age of Sigma and 40k. Mm -hmm. So, so Space Marines and Fantasy Marines. Like, I really hope that they don't just stick with Space Marines because Space Marines are kind of a bit like they're very cool, but there's there's you're very limited on the kind of stories you can tell. With yeah, them. Uh, they're like you know they're just kind of stoic warriors of ultimate loyalty and heroism who never falter mm. and it, it gets a bit old you can't really relate to them or do many much, much character stuff with them yeah oh man fuck me I bet a million people probably not a million because no one cares that much Horus Heresy nerds are just like no space marines are the most <laughs> did you not remember this passage from this book where a space marine this one guy he he was almost frightened of something, but then he remembered he feared no evil. <laughs> he had internal conflict for a moment, but then realized they were filthy Xenos. And I was fear incarnate. <laughs> and just, oh my <laughs> god, fuck me, guys. Like, um, I, I think they're cool. I love them. And, but oh, yeah. I just, I, I, oh, I've read enough Space Marine stories. I need something different in that world. Yeah, man. Um, so, right. Go. Pitch. Oh, pitch. Uh, Marvel. Marvel has come to you, and they're yeah. like, Baron. Ben, we know you are really into the 40k. 
you're being put in charge of a comic. Oh, it can run wow. for however many issues you want. Mm -hmm. What are you writing? Like, okay. what, what story do you want? What's, what is your... I'm telling the grand story of a downtrodden Imperial scribe who is harassed <laughs> by the war master he's assigned to. Okay. And as the war master attempts to conquer the Abraxas sector, <laughs> yeah. this, this downtrodden, <laughs> underappreciated Imperial Ministorum scribe yeah, yeah. has to find this true heroism in his heart right. to follow through his war master's orders. Okay, okay. I, I can see, you know, I think... Yeah, that's man. Yeah, I, I just for some reason I could just, just that really speak to you, but on some it. level, I just really latch onto it. I want to know more about this War Master character because he sounds <laughs> he sounds pretty fucking good. Um, yeah, he he appears to be like the fan favorite hero of the piece. Right. But the more you get into the mind of the the the, the, the downtrodden scribe, the more you realize he's actually corrupted by chaos all along. The War Master is. Oh, and then. Um, yeah, it's all about his his struggle to expose the corrupt. Oh, war I don't know. I don't like this turn that the story's going. <laughs> now. This is, um, you know, this is alarm bells ringing. Mm. Uh, okay, that sounds sounds kind of fun. I mean, they say write what you know, right? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, just the the book nerd, the book nerd and the boss. Mm. That's cool. Sweet. There we go. I'm sure everyone can can get into that. Uh, yeah. What would yours be? Mm. So, I think we've spoken about this before, like ideas that we'd have for like um, stories or stuff. Mm -hmm. I think maybe when we were talking about films or, I don't know. Yeah, I think it's when um, the Eisenhorn thing got announced and we were like, oh. Well. Damn, that was it. But uh, having, um, do like an Inquisitor, like a real low-level Inquisitor or like, you know, just fucking imperial investigator type person. Mm -hmm. um, they don't need to be a super badass. And do the the shadow over Innsmouth story. Oh, okay, yeah. But From a, with a gene, an inquisitor going into an inducial cult. Yeah, thing. going to this this like town or this hive or yeah. uh, something. I'd like, I'd like them amazing. to have like a smaller community and slowly realizing... Yeah, you just go to some kind of like mining outpost or agricultural colony and... Um, and they just he's just some kind of guy there to check up on the deliveries or to like something really banal. Yeah. And it could even be like, oh, they're um they're over delivering. Uh, you need to go because clearly some fucking machines yeah, look, are wrong. Or go go learn their methods so that yeah, you can yeah. then like teach other colonies to be as efficient as this one is. Yeah, fuck. And so this is like a you know, someone who went through enforcer training mm -hmm. and has never touched a gun since and has now just goes and fucking fuck does some book work yeah and going in and suddenly and he realizing. can't just like call up a space marine chapter because he's yeah, not like yeah. an inquisitor or anything yeah for sure and like you know maybe gets some help from the local mm -hmm. you know the five members of the local pdf who are still you know yeah there's some kind of underground resistance there um, man i would i would watch but that. i think keep it like real subtle like you know this cult gene sealer cult is not at the level where they're going to rise up and right. actually they're sort of chilling because they've got a good life um but they are definitely worshipping a four-armed emperor yeah yeah there is like a gene sealer patriarch and you'd i'd want the old school pot belly fat gene sealer patriarch wearing a gold chain <laughs> of course rather than like the super super alien monster like the kill pig mm -hmm. um something like that well i'm sold uh, i think that'd be just a really really fucking cool Cool story, just a real like kind of slow burn that isn't just non-stop action. Have it, yeah, yeah. Just some world building. Um, I love it. And then because you can just relate to that because this guy looking into it, he's in over his head. He's a normal person. Yeah, there's yeah, some tension right. there. You know, he can't just fucking drop pot attack and destroy the world. Yeah, and isn't a stone cold killer. Mm. He's there with his bolt pistol, killing wave after wave of guys running at him. Yeah. Um, and then every fight is like small and tense. Yeah, yeah. Like suddenly him, he's in a punch up with someone and their third arm comes out and he's like, <laughs> oh shit. What the fuck? Um, and yeah, you could do, you could stretch it out for quite a long time before he even figures out what's up. Yeah. You know? He's just like, this is weird and uncomfortable. Yeah, exactly. Because you can have it. It's weird and it's a bit corrupt and the people look a bit off, but you know, 
this is a hundreds of years old fringe mining colony or whatever. Yeah. Uh, yeah, just really slow burn that. And like, although there are hints that the fans will kind of know, just be like, oh mm. shit. Yeah, the moment there's a bald guy or something, everyone's just like, ah! Oh, it's, not, it's, not, it's him! That's the one! <laughs> and you're like, oh man. Uh, so yeah, that'd be, that'd be what I'd go for. I think that would... Uh, yeah, that sounds great. Um, yeah, I don't know. I think like, I kind of prefer like the sort of more chill stuff. I don't like, just a big war comic. Yeah, I think I've just seen enough action to last me a lifetime now, you know? And, like, I don't think that's what comics do best. Like, um, it was, like, Alan Moore who wrote, who did, like, V Vendetta mm -hmm. and, uh, you know, like, Watchmen and yeah. League of Extraordinary Gentlemen and stuff like that. But uh, I think it was V Vendetta where he, like, kind of wrote this thing. Maybe it was Watchmen. Um, and it was talking about, like, you know, he wants to show off the pros of... Like comics and mm -hmm. you know graphic novels, the things you can do in that medium that that no one else can do. Yeah, um, you know because books are great for you know internal thought. You know, mm -hmm. um, someone's like motives can be completely explained like that, but it yeah. doesn't handle action nearly as well as cinema, which does action yeah. really well um, because but you can then struggles with the see stuff. stuff. Whereas you know, although you can still have people's internal thoughts, it doesn't flow as yeah. easily as it would in a book. Whereas a, a comic can really kind of do both to a degree, like of course. Yeah, because you can do the monologue and you can do some cool looking action scenes. And um, yeah, I really highly rate it. I find that Alan Moore, his like sort of like little essay on why comics are good. And um, hmm. it's really interesting, really good. Um, and then they made that book into a film and he was just like, you motherfuckers. And he hated it. What? He hated the film? Yeah. yeah. Like, I've only seen the film. I haven't read the book. Yeah. Um, he, I think it was after League of Extraordinary Gentlemen. And he was like, I don't want my name anywhere near this. Mm. This is nothing to do with me. Well, the League of Extraordinary Gentlemen was terrible, wasn't it? It was so Such bad. Such a bad film. Do you know that's the film that um, made Sean Connery retire? Really? Because he... Dr. Alan Quatermain. He was offered... Um, Gandalf in Lord of the Rings. Oh yeah, fuck. And he was offered something in The Matrix. Uh, so they went, do you want to be in The Matrix? And he was like, I don't understand The Matrix. Yeah. <laughs> no, biggest film ever. Do you want to be in The Lord of the Rings? I don't understand this. I don't want to be in it. Biggest film ever. It's and then elves. they went, do you want to be in League of Extraordinary Gentlemen? And he went, well, I don't understand it. So sure. But I fucked up the last two choices. <laughs> sure, <laughs> plug me in. Plug me in. And then it just he was just like, fuck this, I'm out. <laughs> like, oh. I'm never, and he's never acted again after that. Man. I've got like I have like the tiniest soft spot for that movie just because I like the source material a lot. Yeah. Um, well, you like that kind of setting, that kind of era of like fantasy tech Victorian. Yeah, kind of yeah, stuff, right? yeah. With like a bit of like spookums. Um, really good. Really like that kind of uh, like pulp Victorian. Yeah. Like not exclusively steampunk. No, but, but just kind of bit sort of silly and fantastical kind of. Yeah, with, like setting. monsters and and shit. Yeah. Really good. And like um. Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde in it looked really good, really, that was like, he was an amazing bit of character design. Oh, it's um, been so long since I've seen it, I can't even remember. Uh, it's bad, it's real bad. Um, I remember even at the time watching it and thinking, this is bad, which, yeah. man, I was an easy fucking lay for like <laughs> action and science, sci-fi and fantasy in back in like late 90s, early 2000s, whatever yeah. it was. Like, wouldn't I take it like you know? I enjoyed the underworld films at the time. Oh man! But even well, that's got Kate. Is it Kate Beckinsale? Kate Blanchett? Kate Beckinsale. Which one? Like holy shit, man! She was very, very attractive in those films. And like young me, seeing that, just like <laughs> yeah. she should a werewolf. This is the best. <laughs> this is like a modern day version of Starship Troopers, <laughs> or a more recent version of that film. Just you know, titillates all the right parts. There's shooting. There's shooting. There's monsters. There's there's hotness. There's 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 some hotness. Um, bam. Uh, Beckon sale. Is that what she's called? Oh yeah, uh, Beconsole. Uh, <laughs> Coed showers. That's exactly. Oh yeah. That's exactly. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh. exactly um, yeah. Right. Um. 
kind of been okay, fucking right. everything up, Tom. Okay, we've just chatted shit for like 20 minutes. Let's um, do... Should we play the game? Should we, should we do some stuff? Well, I've got some units to name. I think people are here for the Because what game. I've done is, Not Case Cage, he recruited an army at the end of the last stream. Hello there. And I thought, there's a vampire horde over here. Let's go get that with nice. this random army. But I had to recruit some uh, blessed warriors Ooh, to get it. Blessed. Uh, and they need names. Sure. Blessed okay. Sauruses. Uh, okay, we've got the Quenor. V. Quen. Or. You're in. Cool. Another one. Uh, we've got Brother Eggblooders. Brother. Oh, jeez. Uh, then we've got three units of special skinks. Special skanks. Mm. Um, okay. Right. There's Zerolith. Zerolith. Okay. Another one. Uh, and then um, get toasty. Get. Toasty. Holy shit. Wow. Toasty. Um, Very toasty. Cute. And we'll like read the messages yeah. out in a minute. Yeah, we'll get back to the messages. Don't uh, worry. We'll, we've not, not forgotten. Shimmy Sham. Bam. Okay, that's all the new ones named. I just wanted to name them before we go into fight. Because we desperately need the treasure that's on this island. Um, because... Um, well, it we're, be, we're bankrupt. It wouldn't be us if we weren't bankrupt. Raid the cove! Let's do it. Ooh, Ooh, they're not normally... The last time I fought one of these battles, the army was significantly worse than this. You can win that? Well, actually, you have to win that. Tom, there's no retreat option. <laughs> okay, fuck it. Um, I guess, like, you could retreat in battle. Yeah. Give it, give it a go, though. Like, give it a... Go. They don't have a ton of fight, man. Do we still have um, raptors? You didn't let me recruit raptors. I tried to recruit raptors, and you were like, no, they have to be recruited this turn, and raptors took two turns. No, um... Oh, teleport raptors. Teleport raptors. I if that might have worn off by now. Fuck, if sure. we've got that, that would help. Um, we'll see. We'll see. Hmm. Um... Well, if this army dies, if they win, money problem solved. That's true. And if, if we die, lose, money problem solved. It's a it's a win win then. It's a win win. Okay. So who's here? Let's get a little roll call for B -b 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 roll call. Um, okay. How fucky do we want to be? Because we could get boys going in real quick yeah well the birds could get the um, get the artillery killed real fast yeah but their army's not gonna move a ton are they no they're gonna sit and shoot us but just putting the birds behind would force well, all their guns to 180 which would take a while well, I'm just thinking like do we oh, you skank up the flank skank up the flank um, we bring all the Inf up here because this hill is going to be so fucky for oh, their yeah, arm. Like, yeah, well, the cannons, not the um, mm, not the mortars. But the mortars, we could like get the pterodons into really quick. Oh, look, the cav can um, flank. Cav can redeploy. Oh shit! Well, maybe they just um, hide in the woods until something's going on. Mm. Um, so it's just the source that can't. Okay, well, fuck. Cool. Let's just uh, two front set. How's that look? I know they're in get the thing. get the Lord like in the middle, I reckon, just to he's not sticking out. Wow. They are. It's weird calling them red crested skinks because they are Well these are the uh, regiment of renown one. They're like the special ones. Let's go for the target. What do they do? What's so special about them? They refuse to die. Ah oh, they've got a cooldown and they're immortal while the cooldown's active. Fuck me. And they're unbreakable. Wow. Okay. That's pretty cool. Okay, right. Well, I just want to get those guys up. Just running up here. And Birdos can just go to town. Get the skinks in? Yeah, I'm just going to get the birds kind of maneuvering. And okay. then I'm going to worry about the skinks. Because they are on skirmish mode. So these guys are probably going to have to try and get the deck guns. Um, or the deep guard. Uh, yeah, the deep deep guard. 
Well, three of the four pterodons have got the fire bombs, like the fire swings. Oh, he's got like blunderbuss. Okay. Wow. Wow, blue pipe. I thought blue pipes would do more to unarmored zombies. So they can't see them properly. Oh, right, they indirect fire. Okay, well, they should skirmish a bit. Oh my god, the spearmen are getting fucked by mortars. Oof. Ugh. Um, birds into mortars? At least. Oh, his general's poking his head out. Okay, we might just have to drop bombs on anything and just start whittling down some peeps. These guys got two bombs. Is that not sure? Blammo! Nice. Uh, oh, fuck. They're going to die if they go too ham. Yeah, mm. actually, I just don't even want that. We'll just shoot them. Shoot them all. Okay, well, I'll quickly will just break. Uh, oh, right. That's going to be you guys. You can come in. Everyone else, just keep coming up. Ooh, they are. I'm getting shot up pretty bad. But we've got loads of bombs to drop. They just want to go and shoot him. Ooh. Oh, jeez. Got so much shooting. Our poor birdos. That's too many guns. God. Oh, God, Ben. This is, this is going to go really bad, isn't it? Yeah. Real bad. It's like, our guys are all fucking shot. Just everything's getting shot. What about the treasure? I wanted the treasure, Tom. So, like we said, <laughs> the treasure, we had the treasure all along. The treasure was death. And the treasure was our guys dying. Um. Oh, maybe you can blowpipe the crab. Is that going to do anything to him? I don't know. In tabletop, blowpipes are really good against large monsters. Well, because they're poison. Because they're poison, and you had a million shots, and most large monsters didn't have an armor save. Right. Um, well, at least a very low armor save. So multiple, multiple poison shots into a big boy. I don't good. think it's doing anything because he's definitely armored. Yeah. Oh god, he's got armored 150. Yeah. Fuck that. Shoot the deep guard behind him or the zombies, whatever they are. Trigger the um, red crested skinks immune to death power. That's a good call. Don't really want that. Cav, please. Uh, okay, that fight is happening. You guys just upset Artie as much as you can. Oh God, don't really have the, the meat to deal with that. Uh, you guys just come up on the flanks and maybe so engage it. Oh, the mortars! The mortars! Oh, fuck, we can't getting stuck. Yeah. Okay. Well, the real treasure was the... It's the friends we lost on the way. way. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit, yeah, that calf got absolutely fucked. Back. What are blowpipes good at if they can't even kill light infantry? Well, those are um, the depth guards. So oh, okay. Well, they're not that light. Um, and they're only shooting back because everyone else was sad. I don't think we've got enough meat over there to um, no, I don't either. upset people. Okay, bombs are all dropped. 
Crap's gonna be dead. <laughs> yeah, fuck. Soros, our Soros Lord is just killing everything he's into. Yeah, he's he's being very well behaved. And uh, Kay's... Kay's is a good boy. Fuck, you guys want to just keep going. Um, and you just try and tie them up. Oh, that's not a good, that's not a good fight. Krabulon still fighting, and he's going to get butchered. So you know, Depth Guard coming in. Maybe we should be splitting the Skink's fire up, because they apply a poison debuff. So we could poison three separate units, right? Oh, just fuck. Triple poisoning one unit. Oh, okay. I was just using them as like a kill, a kill boy. Yeah. I'm not sure what's better. I've never really found a good way of using Skinks, I have to admit. Yeah, I find them tough. I find like a lot of the sort of like super light skirmishy troops hard to use. Uh-oh. Rot row. I think it's because of the the cap, like, because you can only take 20 units in a stack. Yeah. The light units would be more useful if you could have an unlimited number of units, because they wouldn't be all instead of something else. Yeah, that's it. Like, yeah, it feels kind of like, you know, armies like Chaos mm. should only have 10 units in a stack. Mm. And you have to use, move more stacks around, like, whereas Skaven should be able to get 40 units in a stack. Yeah. Um... Act. Okay. <laughs> Who did we lose then? We lost um Cat Sawfish. Viquenor and Governor Tarkin. Ouch. Shit. God, that's the immortal unit of skinks. When the moment I saw unbreakable skinks. <laughs> you right. knew their days were numbered. Pretty sure they're gonna die. Because they're gonna Ouch. stand there and keep fighting. Um, we did alright, we killed a few units. Yeah, not many. Okay. Well that's just a warm up. Rip. Rainy. Oh, look, we completed our quest, though, and got four units of Blessed Spits. Hey! hey oh, and uh, uh -oh. we're still bankrupt. Uh-oh. Do I just kill some of these... Do I just... God. Do I just cull some of these boys? Uh... Look at the Mysterious Island. Where... What else is going on in our empire? Um... So we've just conquered these Skaven territories, but I was thinking we'd get some money for doing this, but it turned out... Um, oh, you could have put him on a Ripodactyl. Oh, shit. Is it too late to undo? Yeah. I'll have to wait till next time. Oh. Uh, so, yeah, we conquered Dawn's Light and the Scrag Hole. But it turns out they were both garbage and we didn't get any more. <laughs> That's okay. Wait, um, are you um, building stuff? Do you want to cancel it? No, no, no. I'm um, demolishing this. Oh, okay. For money. Okay. Um, Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, indeed. Oh, my mouse. For fuck's sake. <laughs> Every stream I have a shit mouse. <laughs> so annoying. So that's um, it. We can't afford a new one, Ben. Look, look at our money. It's true. We're bankrupt. We're bankrupt. We can't afford a better mouse. I can switch this back. Uh, income. Ooh. Forgot that was on swords from last time. Uh, so last a couple of turns ago, I did try to upgrade all of our money houses. Okay. Um... Do we just take we take a turn of attrition? Yeah. All the money houses pop. Um, it kind of sucks, but like that's going to drop a bit, and we can hope for the best. How are the last defenders doing? Are they? They've bounced back. They were on the ropes. They were nearly out of the game. Yeah. Um, but they confederated with um, Zatlan. Right. Okay. Um. Sure. Zatlan. Hmm. Good job, guys. <coughs> Uh, so we got some donors then. We did. Uh, the Quenor is here, and they say, Dom, Ben, the Quenor. Uh, how's the sexy Warhammer duo doing? I'm back in yeah. the Moblin pile this week. Uh, Rip Chiron. Uh, sorry, I missed Ben's love for the 1986 Transformers movie starring Leonard Nimoy and Orson Welles. Yeah. Um, if you were Transformers, what would your alt modes be? Oh. Mm. Boombox. That's taken. That's Soundwave. The best okay. Transformer. Um, By your command. No, that's not what he says. He says, um, Soundwave, superior. Constructor cards, inferior. <laughs> Damn. That's good smack talk. <laughs> so Ravage, can, eject. So you can transform into something. What are you transforming into? Um, oh, got some money. Ooh. 
Ah, oh, what do I transform into? I don't want to be something like... I always felt like Megatron really missed a trick. Um, yeah, but he can be like a tank and a plane, right? No, no, in, in like original Transformers, he turned into a gun that one of the other Decepticons had Oh, yeah, hold. fuck, yeah. <laughs> it's like, that Shit. sucks. <laughs> oh, someone shoot me. And then, like, Soundwave turned into a cassette player, which was dumb. Like, anyone who turns into something that just can't do anything on its own. Yeah. Kind of terrible. Um, I liked, uh, I was like Astro Train. <laughs> yeah. Because everyone climbs inside like him, him. And yeah. he just like, boop, 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 boop. He uh, trains along for a bit, and then he turns into a shuttle. Yeah. And flies off into just, space. That's like a fun, fun thing. Because being the person, like, I think I'd be so disgustingly inappropriate about it. Because <laughs> everyone has to get inside me to go, to, like, the, go on the mission. To go to Cybertron like, or whatever. Oh, everyone, get inside. <laughs> oh, stop touching. And, <laughs> the they're like, and they're like, it doesn't tackle. We know it doesn't tackle. <laughs> stop making this weird. <laughs> it's weird enough already. Uh, so something like that. Yep. Um, I, can, I can get on board. Or... I don't know. Half of me would be like, okay, you want something practical that's cool, but the other half wants something dumb. <laughs> yeah, dumb and funny. Really dumb and funny. <laughs> yeah, like a watch. <laughs> <laughs> like, a, like a watch. I had a Transformers watch. It wasn't like official licensed Transformer, but it was um, It was basically like a watch that you could like detach off your, your like strap. Yeah, yeah. And then it folded, its legs and arms folded out, and it was a little robot. Um, that's kind of, and, that's kind uh, of fun. I fucking loved it. It was like cheap and shit and felt and broke immediately. Uh, but um, yeah, that was a good one. What about something like, just like, like a phone? They're like, quick, we need to get hold of this person. You turn into a phone and then that person has to pick you up, <laughs> talk into you. And it's like, yeah. this is the dumb. This like, feels surely, so inefficient. Surely the robots should just be able to have that, that tech. <laughs> uh, yeah, it should be built into there. Their heads. Something, something like that. Um, yeah. I want that level of just like trash. <laughs> like I could turn into a George Foreman grill. <laughs> <laughs> I love the idea that when you transform, you've just got like massive grill marks down your <laughs> yeah, chest. Yeah, yeah. And like a handle on your back. Yeah, yeah. And just like. Oh, and <laughs> you've got like the fat tray. Yeah, the fat tray. Falls out of your stomach. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> Amazing. Um, yeah, something just like, why do we have you? Why are you here? Um, Amazing. I love yeah. it. Yeah, I think uh, I think that I think that'd be good. Someone wants to be a lawnmower. Very good. A saxophone. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> like that's kind of the same level. Uh, oh, can I be a Rude Goldberg machine? <laughs> a Rude Goldberg machine. You just change into like just fuckloads of shit <laughs> all over the place. Yeah. And like you know, the, the boot kicks the marble. Yeah. It knocks into the spring. <laughs> Do people have to set you up? Because that sounds like. You basically just turn into a cardboard <laughs> box of trash. <laughs> and he's like, I'm a Rude Goldberg machine. And everyone's like, oh, okay, I'm fine. an Ikea Rube Goldberg Putting machine. Putting dominoes and <laughs> yeah. sellotaping stuff together. Yeah. And someone accidentally sets off a bit of it. <laughs> oh, fuck, that's a lot of Skaven. Yeah, I think we've kicked the hornet's nest here. Uh-oh. Um, so it's just Tic-Tac-Toe's army against uh -oh. Queek's Storm Vermin. Brigade. That's not so good. And then two... Oh, and then the, the, the garrison. Settlement garrison. And then two stacks of March to get here. I mean, we could... Doesn't feel... We could back off and wait for the dinos. Right. Yeah, I think maybe turn. get the dinos as well. Someone said vibrator. That was like my <laughs> instant... I was thinking, like, become a sex toy. Yeah. Um, of course you thought that. But, you know... What happens if something goes wrong? <laughs> what if, what if you really like? Do you think like how, you know how sometimes you just get an itch and you have to scratch it as a as a human? Do you think sometimes as a transformer they're just like I've just got to transform? Like this is so uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> I guess so. Yeah. Um, you don't want to like burst someone in half. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I thought you were going from the angle of oh, wouldn't it be embarrassing? The <laughs> <laughs> uh, everyone sat on Astro Train. And they're like, I'm going to change into a car. I also am a car. I'm a tank. And you're like, 
Oh fuck! I have to just transform right now. I just there's a fucking vibrator just <laughs> with your face <laughs> on the end. <laughs> Don't look at me! But you know how some transformers have um, they uh, like they're a car and then they have like a hologram where they hologram the human driving the car. Yeah, yeah. Oh god. <laughs> how does that work with the sex toy? Yeah. Because if you, you want to disguise yourself, you have to hologram the human. A who's person <laughs> who's just fucking going going ham. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, ooh. That's how that works. Ooh. Um, uh, people are requesting to have a vibrator with your face on it, Ben. <laughs> okay, coming up. Use Ghost Ben at checkout at the yogstars.store.com. <laughs> uh, yeah, you have to use that code so it has Ben's face engraved. Um, ooh. ooh. Careful what you wish for, people. Okay, I've done, I done the locked door trick. Nice. Um, the dinos have locked the door. The birds have swooped in. Fuck, look at that guy's glowing warpstone horns. Oh. So the two armies that marched up as reinforcements. Idiots. Oh, now fucked, mate. Idiots. Do you want to do it so that the dinos get, don't get wrecked? Nah, fuck it. Just, just, just numb them. Um, okay, they're, they're toast. Um, they, of course, cheat and keep units alive after having marched. Wow, there's a lot of bucks. There's a lot of bucks. I like that a lot. That solves, um, solves a good amount of issues. Who's done good? Twisted Tide. Oh, no, no. He's done aside. Samwise. Best saw a CU. Ooh. He's that's ding it. He's up level seven. Um, Trapo doing, doing God's Holy work. Shit. And King of the Birds is Uncle Bulgaria. Wow. Real. Oh, real seven. bird lord. Um, oh, the dinosaurs didn't get oh, too didn't get mangled. There's a 52 kill. Mega, mega, mega dino. No, let's eat them all. Yeah. Um, 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 um. It's probably not a good idea to eat loads of like disease-ridden. <laughs> no, you wouldn't want to eat the clam pestilin rats, would you? Yeah. Ugh. Ugh. Uh, brother Ink Blotters has donated Ben. Brother. And they say, Brother Tom, Brother Ben, it is I, your beloved turgid Brother Ink Blotters, oh. here to deliver more sweet kisses. Mwah. Uh, since I missed last week. Can I see a reenactment of you two reuniting and Ben doing his happy brother Tom is back dance? Did that happen? Did I do a happy dance? I don't, I don't normally do a Was happy Ben dance. happy? It doesn't sound like Ben. Did Ben get happy? He doesn't happy very often. Um, I imagine it went like this. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that dance. I think I've seen you do that three times on different streams. <laughs> yeah. It's my go-to bad dance. Well, it's hard to like you know get that much more movement when you're sat down. <laughs> yeah. um, and also, you know, <gasps> boom. Ba 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 ba. You did it, broccoli. You got what one video has shown us to be the best spell in the game. <laughs> yeah, holy fuck, pal. Look forward to doing that later. We need to get him a bird. Um, but then he gets a bird for free. Oh, really? Being I just, I just never know. Some of them get birds, some of them don't get birds. The, the, the red crested general skinks don't get birds. Okay. Everyone else gets birds. Are they ever allowed to ride a bird? I think, yeah, yeah, he can get the Ripidactyl. Right. But he's got a, a, a raptor for now. Right, okay. Uh, right, so we can, we can just, we can do it now if you like. We can take the castle. Now we've locked, locked the door. Ooh. Um. What do you think? Do you want to just send in the, the fucking dino? What have they got? Have a look. The, yeah, that looks like pretty winnable. Because once you bust through the gate, because I think it's just really against us because um, because of no siege equipment. Yeah. Yeah, and I think the pterodon bombs will make a mess of them on the walls. Yeah, we do the walls. We just rock up all the saurus. Uh, the dinos go through the gate. Um, they eat stuff. There's only one unit of um, uh, anti-large guys, mm -hmm. and so I think the dinosaurs win this. Cool. I'm up for a fight. Let's do it. I'm down. Down to pound. Um. Uh, amazing. Good times. Um, we just got a $100 donation from Holy Chiron. Holy shit. <laughs> We're doing the, the Ben's party dance. <laughs> Thank you, Chiron. Holy shit. Fuck me. I can't believe you still love this stream enough. Wow. To, to drop the hundos. I'm surprised anyone loves this stream. It's just yeah. nonsense. I can imagine someone getting tricked into it <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> once and then go, oh, I can't wait. And then we read out their message and we name a unit and they're like, 
I will oh, instantly fucking die. I regret this. <laughs> what am I doing with my life? Because Pyron had these, a lord. These we, nerds. He got killed. Do you remember he got ambushed by a Skaven army and um, fled into the forest, never to be seen again, <laughs> <laughs> along with the it dinos we disbanded? Happens a lot. Happens a lot. Um, so we'll have to get him a new lord when we can afford it. Pow. Um, he says, Tom, got track. Ben, Felix. Yeah, that kind of sounds. That, that works. That sounds about right. Um, how are you two fine gents? Looking forward to some more Explorers with my Saurus, if I'm still alive. Ooh. No, we'll get you another one. You Sorry. Riferino. Or hard. do you want the next slan? Because we've got a quest. Maybe a slan? Oh, fuck, man. We've got a quest to get a slan. Oh, OK. If there's a quest slan, that's OK. Uh, maybe we can give you that. Because I'm, I'm not going to be doing good magic. Um. I don't know. I'll have to have a look how hard it is, but we do have a quest that gives us a thousand bucks if we get a slam. So maybe Where are the reinforcements? Are they behind the little fucking market? Oh, yeah, he's hot for a slam. He says, Toad Boy, Best Boy. Toad Boy, Best Boy. Awesome. Um, he says, I finished Ghoul Slayer today, the newest Got Trek novel. It's a good read, but it's not the same without Felix, Cryface. Yeah, I saw that that had come out. Because um, it's now the Age of Sigmar version of Got Trek and Felix. Oh, uh, okay, where he's... Even Kilia. Well, he's the demigod of G Grimnir. Right. Okay, well, he says it's good. Maybe. Um, That's cool. Man, I, like, I think if the... Um, oh, I did choose the right spot. If the... What are they called? The, the Flesh Eater Kingdoms had come out. Yeah, because they've just put them in... Um, They've just uh, announced them for Shadespire. The I Ghoul really game. like the look of that gang. I really like ghouls. Mm. I've always been a big fan of ghouls. Like, they're super disgusting. Um, I just think, like, the army they have is really bland. It's like... Well, yeah, you just ghouls and then big ghouls. Ghouls, there are big ghouls. And there's a, a ghoul riding a, a zombie dragon. Mm. And that's it? And like that's kind of it. Maybe there's some other stuff. Fuck knows. Um... Uh, but I really like I really like that idea. But um, oh shit, those could be some prime fucking bombing runs. Mm. I'll come back and I'll eat those guys. Um, are they not manning their towers? Yeah, they are. No, oh, yeah. it's shooting. Firebomb. Oh, you have to wait. The oh no, you don't have to wait. What? Uh huh. Okay. No, if they're different bombs, you're okay. Mm. Uh, oh, nice, okay. They're getting into fun positions. Uh, get Toasty has donated. He's donated $30. Holy shit, man. And we put Get Toasty into that last army and they died. Did they actually die? Were they oh, I don't know, because um, the army didn't die. The army didn't die. No, I put it in for healing. Um... Kitoski says, got the work off, got the day off work today, oh. so I can tune in for the whole stream of mass extinction event. <laughs> oh, he's on board. He's on board with the mass yeah, extinction. He, right, at least you know you know what's going on. <laughs> he knows the drill. Um, no one wants to live forever. Uh, wow. Oh, uh, wizard. Mr. Blue Skies. Broccoli, deploy chain lightning. He's the one with the skull face. That right, one. okay. I was no, that's the lightning bolt. This one. Yeah. Oh, fuck it. He's just probably not close enough. Okay. Well, he's on a bird. He'll get there. He'll get there quick. Oh my god, I'm loving this. The, just the carnage. Oh shit, the dinos just broke in. It is a mess down here. Oh my of god. Bombs and. And then the lightning's about to go off any second. Hey, man, by the time the lightning goes off, it'll be way too late. <laughs> yeah. Fuck, where is he? He's, he's right there. He's been shot to shit. He started on low health. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, he cast it. Yeah, that would have been amazing 20 seconds ago. Uh, but a lot of their stuff has got mangled anyway. Yeah. That's um, there he goes. If you want to just come in here. Uh, thanks, Captain Tasty. Uh, we've got Zach Shimishan. Yeah, and I did $18. Much. Thank you very much. Hey. And he says, Bed and Tron. Long time no see. After the last major update while playing as Empire, I seem to get random generals named Tom or Ben, what? followed by a Germanic last name. No way. No way. Have you picked up on this? 
Or was it always in the game? Or have I only just noticed it? I don't know. I don't play as Empire really very often. So, hmm. I like it. Do I get my my royalties for that? Uh, ooh, hopefully. I feel like it wasn't in the game because I did play one Empire campaign, like when it first came out, and I would have noticed if there was something called Ben. I think it was like Benedictus. Benedict. I think it was Bon. Bon Jamon. Bon Jamon. God, you've just, just smashed them. Is it was it just all the dinos coming through the gate that's completely broken? I think um it was them they just started playing uh funny rats. Um and all of their units just moved through each other. Oh, and then you bombed them. Yeah, and just a bunch of them just got wiped out to the point of like skulls appearing just from a single bomb being dropped off. Wow. I guess they're packed in so tight, the skaven. Yeah. I mean, they get really fast. Oh, so storm for them. I never knew that pterodactyls were this good. Is it tic tac toe making them better? Or were they always this good? Honestly, don't know. Hmm. Thanks, actually, Shen. So we, we named a unit after um, Zeralith donated and says Croxigor, Ancient Tom, and Skink Priest Ben. Can I grab a unit or a town or something? Also, Tom, now that you're streaming again, are you going to start streaming on your own channel again? I need more things to watch while painting. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I started streaming some Warhammer as well. <gasps> uh, Without you know. me, you hussy. Uh, if anything, it's terrible, Ben, because <laughs> suddenly I have to do do Ben work. Oh, no, you hate um, Ben work. I really do. Um, and, uh, yeah. We'll probably be doing that tomorrow. Shameless self plug. Oh, you plug yourself, man. Shameless self plug with my little um, transformer. <laughs> um, just transforms into a plug. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh, I'm just like a sink plug. <laughs> oh, no, I meant like a wall plug. <laughs> like oh, okay. A, an electric plug. There's so many different plugs because this all starts out with like a butt plug, right? Is that not where our brains were? That's where my brain was. Was it? <laughs> Right, that T Rex is probably. Who knew Transformers were so sexy? Man, what is it? We just find, like, <laughs> the sexiest content. Secret sexy content. Oh my god, half your army isn't even there. Yeah, it's just all the, like, random random bits and bobs. Like, they didn't have a direct job to do in here. Um, okay, well, you guys. Oh. Clan rats, shields. Oh, there's a storm for Maybe Man, can, um, people should know when they're beaten. I think you need to get me in closer. Okay. It's quite short range by the looks of it, that spell. Alright, you guys, you are the sacrificial unit. I mean, the <laughs> stalwart <laughs> line holders. There we go. Broccoli's Storm of Doom. We've leveled him up. Oh my A god. Lot. So he can do this. Oh my health. god! Uh, fuck. Lightning Bolt. You ran on Thunderbolt. Takes a while. Fuck me, it does. <laughs> Pretty good, though. Yeah, I'll take that. Uh, very good work, Broccoli. Very good work. Shit, that dino's having a sad day. Oh Send in more it's dinos. More dinos. Um, yeah, I think you only took a break from streaming on your own channel to when you were away, right? You're yeah, I went away. Now. I went away for like two weeks, um, but I'm back. Let's say streams, streams back. Watch out, the wizard's getting shot. What? Right there, you were looking right at him. There, him. Yeah. There's like one nerd through a through a dart. No, oh, there's like three units throwing darts. It's like a nerd, it's just one nerd. Look. He's got so little health, Tom. He's not a, like a legendary lord, he won't just come back. He'll be dead forever if he dies. We've only just got him to the lightning spell. <laughs> it's taken ages. Yeah. This is a real just control. Control A, everyone go. Oh, Kim's raiding us. Hello, Kim people. Yo, what's up? Welcome to the Warhammers. Uh, cool. Right, what's going on? Uh, we got uh, Jippy has donated. Jippy? And says, Blumus Trumus. Uh, I finally am back with the... What? 
the Rat Zoblin pile. Here to be entertained with 100% accurate, sexy Warhammer lore. Thanks, Chippy. Thank you. Thank you very much. I've got another donation from that guy Spartacus. Who that says, guy Spartacus? That guy Spartacus. The only one. There aren't any others. That's how that works. Uh, dearest Tic Tac Tom and Bedgar. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Uh, last week saw the tragic demise of my sweet, innocent Steggy boy. Oh well, more meat for the grinder. Name something else in my honour and send me to serve in our glorious Wizards Overlords. Much love. Thank you. Ooh. Thanks, Spartacus. Thank you. Man, fucking amazing victory here. Uh, can I have a tissue, please? Uh, yeah. I have a whole box. Wow. Oh. <laughs> 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 Thank you. Gotcha. I'm not sure who who wins or loses there. Mm. How'd everyone do? Very good. Um, I think something might have died. Actually, shit. I'm really surprised. Wow. Look at that, Lord Cold. Very nearly dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was the person that I sent shit. to take the center, which was just like. Three units of night runners and a bunch of skinks, a uh, bunch of slaves with slings. Holy so he was getting shit. shot a lot. Look at this, Clackling got 170 kills. Clackling's not even a special. They're just regular birdos. <laughs> and I think they were the one. There's a point where all of the Skaven units were like in column formation. Mm -hmm. And I think they said, everyone on the right hand side, you go to the left. Everyone on the left hand side, you go to the right. <laughs> and they just formed oh, the Giga Ball. And you just as bomb, he was bomb, flying bomb over and just hit everything. And two of those units just went <laughs> down to nothing. So <laughs> Amazing. Uh, uh, that's good work. I, mean, everyone, I can't believe everyone survived that. Yeah, geez, man. This has got to have broken the back of um, whatever clan this is. Clan... Uh, it's Queek. Queek. Clan Queek. Mordkin? Mordkin. Moors. Clan Moors. That's is it Clan Moors? Um, amazing. So, uh, yeah. should we put Identity Ken on his Ripperdactyl? Yeah, 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 why not? Bad, bad boy for you. Uh, I think. So, Ripperdactyls are just mightier like versions of Terror. <laughs> That's what I think. Uh, you can do more training. He's the dino trainer, so K. Brent, he's getting all the. Um, teaching them how to sit up. Yeah. And stay. Yeah, yeah. Identity Ken. Um, the dino lord. Very good. Tiptoes down. Okay, so what's actually in this castle? Oh, cool, a source house. We've actually only got one of those in our empire. So sure. Why not? Handy to have another. And a meat pile. Meat pile. I'll keep that just because these armies desperately need healing, and this gives gives a heal. Yeah, fucking like, once we cement this place up, actually having that building providing growth and stuff. Yeah. Because soon our fronts are going to go to the top, unless we want to take out the little islands down here. Um... But fuck it, whatever, mm. whatever. Didn't even know um, what to do with Kay's cage. Uh, Hip Lemming, uh, one oh seven. Hey, hey, uh, hey. They donate thirty six bucks, Ben. Ooh. Holy shit! Thank you very much. Thanks. Um, and they say Tom, Ben, uh, first time donator. And oh. Mod Goblin, uh, work gets in the way of streams. Been watching since the Tretch days. Wow. Um, I love the stream, and I wanted to thank you for the content. And introducing me to the amazing lore of Warhammer. <laughs> it is amazing. Isn't it is it? amazing. It's amazing how much of it... Like, a lot of the stuff that people read at home, really boring. Yeah. But the lore that they come here and the find true, out about... The true lore. Best lore. Much more exciting. Uh, have some beers on me. Wow, holy shit. Thank you very much, Hip Lang. That is super kind. And we appreciate it. Welcome uh, from the Vodgoblin. Yeah. I, I do like the... Um, the term Vodgoblin. Is now on all the other streams. Every other stream, people <laughs> refer to it as being a yeah. Vodgoblin and being in the Vodgoblin pile. And I think a lot of those people don't know what the connotations <laughs> of the Vodgoblin pile actually They just think is. it sounds like a fun word they've it's read like, in chat. Oh yeah, we're a Vodgoblin. <laughs> 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 That's funny. They don't know that it's a sweaty scramble to impregnate each other. <laughs> and everyone is just butt-sexing each other, <laughs> yeah. um, which is... And occasionally a spawn ball of dicks <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like that is, that is some rich um, stream. People lore. need to get onto the deep law <laughs> before they declare themselves vod goblins. <laughs> and yeah, because it means something very different to what you think it means. And I really, 
I've um, really enjoyed that. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Especially when I'm, sometimes I catch someone else's stream and it's some people who are streaming who, like, I've never told them about it. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah, so it's yeah. just like, um, like a random, I don't know, like, um, like Lewis and Duncan are playing Minecraft and they're reading out uh, a donation and it's like, oh, so hey, I'm from the Vod Goblin pile. And they're just like, cool, sounds good. Vod oh, Goblins. Yeah, the Vod Goblins. <laughs> hey, Vod Goblins. And you're like, oh no, Lewis. <laughs> oh no. Oh. Wow, maybe we should make a fucking Vod Goblin t shirt. Oh, yeah. Um, ooh, what would that be? Oh, do you think another streamer will be like, no, the, the Vod Goblins are my people. You're stealing my meme. Vod Goblin, <laughs> that's what I came up <laughs> with. Oh, <laughs> yeah. shit, another one of those arguments. <laughs> Oof. Um, um, we'll see, maybe. Because yeah, we're looking to, like, make another. another. We haven't done a shirt for ages. A t shirt. Um, I always want to make something other than a t-shirt, but I can't think of something good that people are actually going to want to buy, you know? Well, also, it's like a weird one, because, like, um, just from the, like, the merch, merch people talking about stuff, like, you can make, like, kind of, like, cooler, weirder stuff, but t-shirts is what, it's, like, the thing that people buy. Yeah, that's it. Everything else is, like, people, like, like the idea that it exists, but they don't actually want to buy it. Yeah, like, um, so... I guess like a t-shirt. Also, it's kind of fun. I kind of mm. like t-shirt because um, if you're into something, it's you can buy it and like support those people. Yeah. But you can directly, physically get it's it something yourself. you can actually use. Yeah, because we could make some custom Warhammer dice or something like that. But a lot of people don't play Warhammer. Yeah. Wouldn't, wouldn't use the dice. Um, that's it. Although maybe we should make custom Warhammer dice. They can't be any worse than the one GW. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. I can't believe how bad their custom dice are. Like, oh, holy fucking. I shit. love them. I really love them. You love derpy, terrible things. They are <laughs> so bad. <laughs> and oh, there's just a couple of them I really, really want because they are just awful. <laughs> dice are the shiny click clacks. Yeah, someone sent me that tweet. What was the shiny click clack? It was um. Uh, saying people with dice are like role playing or like they're like fantasy races mm -hmm. and so either you're a halfling who's like I'll just borrow my friend's dice <laughs> or right. an elf who has like one or two carefully chosen sets of dice that they take great care of right? or you're a goblin and it's like <laughs> Goblin like the shiny number click clacks. <laughs> Must get more. 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 All the, all the click clacks. All the click clacks I can carry. <laughs> and just like, oh, yeah, right. um, yep, yeah, yeah. That does sound like me. You are a, you are a dice goblin. <laughs> um, for sure. Man, I've got, got a lot. And I like it. I'm on board. I'm taking That's mine now. I made this. I made this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, so maybe, maybe we'll have a... Uh, a uh, thing, a uh, Vod Goblin t-shirt. Mm. I don't know how you could do it. I don't know if you could have a t-shirt that sexy existing. No, I think um, I think maybe you go with a logo design with like some little hints in the design rather than like a full blown. Oh yeah, yeah, like the logo. It looks like a dick going into an ass. <laughs> exactly, <laughs> with with a background of blurred thousands of asses. Oh yeah, because you could do like a like a V. Like a really long O and a capital D, and like have like the G, <laughs> right. and then the like the O next to it, but like the tip of the D is could going we, into the G and the O. Could we make it like a magic eye design? Oh, okay. it says Vod Goblin and like has blurry patterns. I like. And then you go cross-eyed, and, and you're it's like, just oh, no! <laughs> it's just fucking Goblin butt sex um, in the background. Yeah, I'm into that. Because magic eyes are normally, you know, nice, fun things, aren't they? They're very it's rarely like, like... It's a boat or a dolphin. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, fuck, that makes sense. Uh, oh, man. Chuck Carmichael says, I'd like a shirt you can actually wear in public without embarrassing yourself. <laughs> <laughs> but you came to the wrong stream, didn't this you? This is definitely not the right place um, for, yeah, the Vod Goblin. Oh. Yikes. What about... Okay, stress balls. Yeah. You know, are you. what are those places called? Like Hawkins Bazaar. Have you ever been right. to Hawkins Bazaar? Yeah, and they just kids? have like loads of like random. Just random fucking shit. And you get those like balls with like the, they're full of water or gel or something. Mm -hmm. And they've got like all the little tendrils on it. Mm -hmm. Scale up those tendrils. 
we fucking make a dick spawn uh, ball, stress ball, but lots of little dicks. <laughs> and, you know, you can just sit there, have it at work, a bit stressed, start squeezing it. Give it a go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take your tension out on the on the dick butt ball. Yeah, yeah. Really, really relieve yourself. That, you know. Man, you still, people say you don't still got it, but you still got it, Tom. Still got, <laughs> still got them. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, um, we'll we'll come up with something. A cardio beats chaos gym shirt. I feel like you could do a really dumb fucking, just like a t-shirt, you know, like uh, you got it style. Um, yeah, just, just do, do it. it. Mm -hmm. But cardio beats chaos for sure. Like you know, super easy, super dumb. Um, maybe maybe that'd be funny. Maybe that'd be good. Fuck it, a thousand t-shirts, Ben. We'll have them all out tomorrow. Perfect. Stay tuned. And the um, where's the Krell merch? People say, "Well, Krell is like a copyright thing." <laughs> yeah, that's owned. And someone else thought of that first. I mean, they didn't give him the funny voice, but yeah, and the rich law. <laughs> and the rich law. <laughs> but someone else did get there first. Skelly man called Krell. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Like maybe we were already skirting like close to the line with Toddy. Um, yeah. Although Toddy is an independent creation that is not... Who um, just bears a uh, striking resemblance very, to a well-known yeah, Warhammer yeah. general. All names and people are completely fictitious. Yeah. Well, any similarities. Any similarities is completely um, accidental. Yeah. Um, so don't know. Coincidental. Don't know. Whatever. How they'll... Uh, One of them. <laughs> um. <laughs> Festival little says, nah, CA will let you have Toddy. I'm not worried about CA. It's more the litigious megacorp game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Up. Yeah, exactly. Famously CA, litigious. They're like the friendly, you know, um, old timey guard at the front gate. That's <laughs> like, you know, giving candies to kids and stuff like that. <laughs> yeah. Guarding the megacorp with lightning, which is GW, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, who will literally deploy, you know, their stormtroopers. Oh no, it's like um, it's like Lord of the Rings, right? So it's like the Black Tower of Barak Door is like. <laughs> Games Watch when they can deploy the, the lawyers, which are like the seven riders in black, <laughs> yeah, exactly. who screech out looking for <laughs> anyone like infringing their copyright. Meanwhile, there's just some funny Cockney orc at the gate who's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I saw two hobbits today. <laughs> yeah, Run along, you little scamps. <laughs> just goofing around. Um, so, yeah, yeah, we're worried about oh. those guys. Um, oof. <laughs> yeah, I do not want fucking ring wraiths after me. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Um, <laughs> I just imagine, like, you know, the ring racer flying over <laughs> yeah. and all of those people with their, like, you know, custom resin bit sights. <laughs> yeah. Just they're running. <laughs> <laughs> they're, like, custom Space Marine shoulder pads <laughs> shoulder in their little homemade balls. <laughs> as these things, because they think the ring racer are coming for them. <laughs> yeah. But no, it's us and our fucking toddy shirt. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Oh. Wow, wow, wow. Um, pow. Beautiful. Perfect. Um, Maybe that's the shirt we make, and we tr <laughs> and hope that Tolkien's less litigious than Games Workshop. Oh, fuck! <laughs> oh my God. Although I guess, like, if um, you know, if Tolkien does come for us, we just zombie rat our Tolkien from beyond the grave. Yeah, yeah. But we rat ourselves out to GW, saying this is making fun of you. So then oh. they try to sue us, but then they have to have this internal war. Oh, and then it's like the trolls arguing over who gets to eat the dwarves. Exactly. And, and then we let them argue each other to death at court, and they turn to stone before they can perfect. either of them can eat yeah, us. Yeah, and we destroy both of those companies. <laughs> <laughs> With an intense legal battle. Um, and then we release Tom and Ben Hammer. <laughs> <laughs> and we just kind of make it very similar. Um, but, perfect. you know, distinct enough. I'm in. I'm in too. I did it. You know, fuck taking over your towers. <laughs> yeah. Let's we'll go for where the money is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the. That's <laughs> shit. That's shit indeed. Right, so Tom. Um, hey, okay, right. Back on the game. Let's actually. Because I've just been kind of clicking wildly while talking shit. Doing Ben work. Uh, but yeah, but really badly. So Clan Mord still actually has a territory left somewhere. We've wiped out like all their starters. Is it a little area. island? No, because this is all owned by um, elves. Uh, click on Clan Moors. Yeah, but you know what they're like. It's Skaven, so like it doesn't actually tell you where they are. Um, oh, because they're not on this continent. 
Because there's no root. Oh, they might be there. Yeah, I bet that's them. Oh, yeah, they've literally got an army right next to it. Oh, yeah, there you go. Okay, well, they've got Gar's problem now. Okay. Um, so, they're the only people we're at war with. Ooh. So, the world's our oyster here. We could go fight these elves who have got this territory here and then these three islands here. And, like, block off this little corner. Do we need that territory to complete a set? No, we've, we're actually we're done with for sets now. Everything's complete. So, for completion... Or we, we set sail. We could take out the Sea of Dread. Um, partly, it's close. Also, we never have to worry about those elves, because they'll be dead. <laughs> and then we've got, like, our back secure, haven't like, we? Like, yeah, yeah. Like, literally, we then have... Um, we've just captured Australia in risk. We have... Right. Like a little no place one's ever going to go for it. We can no fill it full of money houses. And just super money house it, a couple yeah. of happy houses, and just bam, take that. Um, that makes is sense. Is Krotgar at war with them? Uh, and I think he probably likes them because uh, they beat up. Oh, no, he doesn't, doesn't like them. They're red. Apparently. He's at war with them. Perfect. Perfect. Fight them because either we ally with Krotgar or yeah. we confederate with Krotgar. I mean, because we're like super unreliable. Um, that may never happen, but he'll like We're it. a trusted friend, <laughs> but I'd never trust him. But he won't trade with us. No. Despite the fact that we both make, like, an absolute fucking killing. Ooh, who's strength rank one? Are we two? Wow, it's because we've crippled our economy with huge armies. Is it super elves? We haven't met them, whoever they are. Is it? Uh, I'm guessing. I it's bet it's fucking Tyrion. It always is. Yeah. Um... Okay, so we'll, we'll gear up for uh, for an elf offensive. Yeah, I, rec I reckon elf war sounds sounds all right. Um. We're gonna have a rebellion up here because we conquered Skaven territory so quickly. Uh, we never actually secured any of it. It's all like very poopy. So look here, like, oh shit! Actually, moving these guys, I moved some armies down to kill the rebellion as soon as it arrived. But moving them here actually brought it down, so it's gonna take two turns to rebel now. Ah, fuck it. Bit of a fuck. Like we're not losing um, money. Shit. Like, have a couple of turns of just, like, clicking. Yeah, just click it through. Okay, let me put some more money houses there. Um, I've been putting, basically, a money house in every single territory. Fuck. Uh, 100%. That's the thing to do. Because, um, yeah, we want to... Also, bam. A couple of turns of just, like, chilling, deal with the rebellions, gear up to fight elves. We fight the elves, and I imagine, by the time elves are done, we will be able to do the next ritual. Yeah, we're closing in on it, actually, aren't we? How's that as a... Oh, and then we basically just turtle up, do the ritual. We do that, and then if, as we always do, we get bored and we start some wars, because it's not called Peace Hammer. <laughs> it certainly is not. It's not called Turtle Hammer. Uh, well, he wants us. He's asking us to declare war on them. I mean, we've only got Tic-Tac-Toe's army down there, because the other ones are about to quell a rebellion. How much is this going to fucking... Is he? He's not even going to care. He won't trade with us or do no, anything. No, that's true. Yeah, wait till we're ready. Wait for right? our reliability to yeah. debuff to cool out. How long does that take to disappear? Oh, fucking ages. And so I think we, like, we are going to do it. Can we not like go to him? Like, send our version of you know the spider or Littlefinger or someone. And he's like, okay. okay, we cannot publicly say we're going to join this war, <laughs> but we, we will, definitely will. We will red wedding these elves. <laughs> yeah, because we're, we're just like chill with them. We're just chill. Uh, we're gonna right. have a big party, and then we've already got a shit reputation for being scumbags. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> and um, just Walder Frey, this shit. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we send our Walder Frey out there and just blow pipes in the um, you know balconies. Pew, pew, pew. I think it'll be good. Okay. I think. We'll I think we'll be fine. Perfect. Um, uh, right. Guys, wait for the rebellion then. Um, um, Dr. Kaber Ant has donated, and they say, Hey, guys, give us whatever you want. Cool. Um, we haven't recruited anything for a little while while we sort out the economy. But, um, Once all those money houses get get done, we'll, we'll have some money. Yeah, and we'll, you know, we'll burn down these um, elf houses. Yeah. And this one's got gold. Yeah. Gold, I say. Kill them all. Um, uh, fuck me. Krokar has so few territories. We may just we, kill him. It might be easier just to roll him rather than actually... Um, That's my kind of him. diplomacy. That's what I'm thinking about. Um, Dave Lister has donated. And they say, hi, guys. No message today. I think you'll find no message. This is a message. Is a message. 
Uh, just have fun with Saurus and Dino. Hooray! We'll do oh, Dave Lister. Thank, thank you. you. That's very kind. Nice to hear from you. Um, and Wise Man the Mountains here. They donate ten bucks. Wise Man, welcome. They say, Mr. Tom, Mr. Ben. So, what do you think of the upcoming Marvel comics from 40K? Oh, we kind of had that conversation. At the I'm more three. worried than I'm excited. They might be good, but if they're like those Warhammer adventure books for kids, it'll truly be grimdark. <laughs> like traveling the warp without an Astronomicon. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't be too worried because <laughs> worst case scenario, it's something you don't like and you don't read and you pretend it doesn't exist. I kind of do want to read um, one of those uh, books for kids. Well, one of them um, is uh, the audio book is narrated by David Tennant. Oh, shit. Okay. Um, and like, you could just pirate that, I suppose, and like see wow. if... And then you wouldn't even have to read it. That's true. And to have it read to you by a charming Scotsman. I know, I've, got an, I've got them back into reading. Oh, really? Um, the... I, don't, I know you weren't like super impressed by him, but Joe Abercrombie's yeah, new book. Yeah, I finished the first one and it didn't do anything for me. Man. Maybe I need to give another try. Uh, his new, new book's out. It's sort of like a new trilogy. Very excited, started reading it. I'm, pretty, I'm getting into it, pretty into it. Hmm. Been, um, yeah, it's good. I like having like a good book because it means Instead of like sitting up for hours on the yeah, internet, yeah, watching garbage YouTube videos and stuff, just doing fucking nonsense. I'm like, I'm gonna go to bed and I'm gonna mm. read the book, and it's better for you. I wanna, I wanna, I know I'm gonna wanna read it for a while. So, oh, it's like midnight, get into bed, and mm. I get like tired when I'm reading in bed, and so yeah. I just like fall asleep. I think that's the problem for me about reading. It's like I get so sleepy reading that I, I read like four pages and I'm like, oh, I'm done, I'm going to sleep. And it makes it so hard to actually finish your Yeah, book. shit, like to keep going. Um, but, um, pow. So, reading like a dumb, dumb kid's book. Why not? Might just be the one. Get like there's quick. one which is like, fuck, like, Very well. Jeff the Adeptus Mechanus versus the Terrors of the Necrons. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like it looks so dumb, so bad. Like one of them's got like a slingshot. <laughs> it literally <laughs> looks like that. Oh man. Oh, actually, should we um, should we go see if Grotkar will pay us for something we would have done for free anyway? Oh, oh, he won't. Uh, if we had have um counter offered, we should have done that. Yeah, that's true. Uh, join war against. Tor Elasaur. Uh, payments. Demand. 2,000 bucks. No. Oh, it's got to be an easy way to do this. Am I doing it wrong? Because people always tell me I'm doing this bit wrong. That, like redoing it every time. I don't know. Can you just like click on the payment? Order it? No, uh, fuck it. Should I just do him a favor? Should I just say, oh, I'll join more? Oh Free. shit! They yeah, want to give me not? extra friend points, maybe. Cool. Bam, you're in. Okay, Temple of Gold. Ooh, and yoink! So they left a bigger, bigger garrison <laughs> than that Temple of Gold, huh? Yeah. Ah, oh, we got special rippers. Oh. Oh, and special crocos. Sacred croxigal. Bam, 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 <laughs> with the big fistos. And gold mine. He didn't even build the flipping flipping gold mine. <laughs> what a well, he's a stupid elf, isn't he? Gross. These elves don't care about gold. It wasn't a beautiful sapphire. <laughs> oh yeah. Ugh. Damn elves. Fucking elves. Uh, um, so yeah, wise man on the mountain. Um, what do we think of the Marvel stuff? Go back to the start of the video, and we. Well, this donation came in before we'd started talking about Oh, uh, okay. Well, hopefully. Hopefully, hopefully you already it. know. Hopefully that'll uh, be But yeah, yeah, I mean, there's a chance it'll be fun, and then that's good. And if it's bad, then it's just another thing I won't read. So yeah, like, I think as long as they do, some, they do some stuff, I think it could be good. You know, Marvel's pretty famous for its comics. Um, and they've, they have so many different, like, writers and artists that work for them that I don't think you need, you need to get too cemented down on. I don't want it to be like a certain type of comic because they do mm. like a ton of like oh, experimental have, stuff. Yeah, it's not all just the big headline Spider-Man stuff. Like they, um, do, they do so much more. And but yeah, I'm cautiously optimistic. Could be cool. Uh, could be could be fun. 
Uh, ooh. Hammer fee has donated 200 bucks, man. What? Holy shit. Hammer fee. Wow, wow, wow. What the hell? Um, Vilcommon. Jeez. Uh, That's amazing. Holy shit. Fuck me. Thank you. Um, they what say, they Tom, say? Ben, uh, it's my dono virginity. Oh, my God. You've gone big on your first time. Like, wow. Just straight in there. No oh toe in the waters for you. Ooh. Uh, uh, <laughs> fucking squan dove into the vod goblin pile. <laughs> Yeesh. Uh, they say, I wanted to pay you back for all the years of free and accurate um, Warhammer lore. It's mm. weird that you specify that it's accurate Warhammer. Mm. It's almost as if it. That's a joke. Nah. It just says it like it is. Warhammer lore. I think, you know, because we're the only place that tells, tells it like it is <laughs> the truth. Um, I've been loving you guys ever since Krell's Forbidden Rod. Wow, back in those days. Oh, wow. That was episode one of us playing Warhammer. Together. And we have continued as Thank we've God. meant to go on. Uh, name something big and stompy after me, or just a skink. I'll be happy anywhere. Wow. Holy shit. Shit, man. Um, bam. Well, yeah, we can get, we can get you in. Definitely. We haven't actually done any recruitment for a while because I've been trying to build the economy up, but we'll definitely get something before the end. Hell. Um, um, but yeah, thank you very much. Wow, wow, wow. Um, wow, wow, we wow. It is super, super appreciated. Like, it helps to keep... keep keeps us going, man. This dumb thing going. Um, and, you know... And it lets us know that people, people like it, people want more. Yeah. Which, like we were saying before, it's nuts. It's crazy, because like, if it wasn't for people like actually making the effort, donating, watching the street, like the VODs and liking it and commenting and stuff, I would just assume no one would want to watch this. Like, I need constant reassurance <laughs> that <laughs> yeah. this isn't a fucking dumpster fire. Because <laughs> it usually <laughs> like, does cause feel... Because it feels like one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because this feels a lot like just us, you know, back when we'd just be sat playing Warhammer together, chatting shit about nonsense. <laughs> yeah. But... Now we're, now we're here. But, you know, you can't argue with the stats. Um, but, yeah, fuck. It's very appreciated. Um, and Thank anyone, you. just, you know, no one should ever feel obliged to donate. Just being here. You yeah. know, say hello in chat. Uh, you know, yeah. watch the VODs. Share, like, share a VOD if you can't. Yeah, that's the thing. Tell you, you got a Warhammer friend? You got a friend you play Warhammer with? They don't watch the stream? Bam. That's, Tell, that's like... Just as good as a donation. Tell the tell the friend. You know, find a friend. Tell the friend. Make, get that friend to watch. Make a friend, make and then months later, reveal your ulterior motive. Exactly. This whole time. Um, <laughs> That's how cults get started. Why not um, get a load of people together, go around someone's house, and watch it live together? You know, mm. make a party. Maybe we should do this. Have it on. Uh, have it on at your games club. Have it on at your games club. Might be super distracting. That, and that might really piss off some... Like all the serious gamers. Um, the people who don't find Warhammer sexy at all. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> exactly. But no, that's a, that's a thing. If anyone, you know, this week is going to be hard. But next week, invite a friend over if they like the stream as well. Well, man, it's 2019. You don't actually invite friends over. You send them a link and you both watch it together at the same oh, time fuck. in the safety of your own home. Well, I kind of... Kind of like the, you don't the have to idea outside. Of, ah. Oh yeah, Gus, we're we're talking to Warhammer fans <laughs> right now. <laughs> who I don't want to go outside. I don't, I don't, we're not going to ask them to go outside for me either. But if anyone can organise some kind of Warhammer stream watching party, send us a fucking tweet. Like you know, take a photo, all of you there. I'd like to see with that. Some chips, some dips. You know, bring some toys. Bring some lube. <laughs> have some fun. Bring some lube. Uh, great. They're um, sallying forth, Tom. Oh, fuck. What They've got a lot of Swordmasters, Tom. Ooh, that's not good. We've got a lot of rocks drop on them. Ooh. They've got Birdos as well. Oh, uh, Bird Wars! Bird, bird Wars! wars. <laughs> um, Feathers or scales, which are the best? Um, pal, let's fucking see how this goes. Quite a lot of people are saying I would never show this to my friends. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's like you may as well show them your porn collection at this point. <laughs> um, um, yeah, yeah, fair enough. Yikes. Do, don't don't do that then. Um, <laughs> if you we're know, your secret shame, keep it that's that fine. way. You that's know, fine. No, I like being that. I like being the secret shame of someone. <laughs> that. That's better than their public shame. Because <laughs> yeah, at least they like, still enjoy it. Um, <laughs> yeah. 
Okay. Uh, uh, but I'm still curious. I want to see. I want to see that the VOD party, or just just, just show it to a friend. You know. Um, Don't forget TikToks. TikToks. You can go with them too. Because uh, yeah, like. Like we don't advertise these streams. Like that's not how. No, I usually forget to tweet about it. Even the minuscule like push of my Twitter doesn't even push it. Yeah, like and so we kind of like rely on sort of just word of just mouth. Word of mouth, randomly yeah. Turning up. Um, so like you know, if you guys are hot, hot for it, tell a friend. Yeah. Maybe see how that goes. Maybe terribly, and you lose all your friends. Hmm. Uh, how big was the reinforcement army? Did we just fucking blitz uh, it? The reinforcement is like a load of like spearmen and archers. It's like the settlement garrison. The main threat is the is the first one. That's got all the swordmasters in. Yeah. Okay. Right. How fucking killtastic are those birds? Mm. Ooh. Um, we just got a fifty dollar donation. Holy really shit! Wow. For um. Mpioge? Mpioge. Mpioge. Holy shit, thank you, Mpioge. It says Tom, Ben. Hey. Glad to see you both. I hope you're doing well. I know I am. Oh, that's good. I like that. A bit of like, you know, boom. Boom. It's positive. Happy, happy, happy boy. Uh, can't wait to see the lizarding nonsense you come up with this time. If possible, and if you could find it in your big hearts, please make me a special boy with all your special boy love. <laughs> be a special boy. Of course. Be a special boy. Yeah, we're going to get on all the. I've just spent the whole first half of this stream building money houses so that we can get more boys. <gasps> oh my god, hundreds of elves who've trained for hundreds of years snuffed out by a rock on the head. <laughs> yeah, I love it. Boom! Oh man, it's so fucking satisfying. Okay, we are getting shot a lot. Um, these guys. We need to drop more rocks, man. Uh, There's like three units of sword muscles chewing us up. Yeah, 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 but I need the rest of my army to actually be fighting. Um, yeah, it's tricky. Can't issue orders while dropping rocks. We need a co-op mode. And one of us can do bird micro. One of us can actually control the army. Uh, yeah. Right. Uh, John S has donated $61! What the hell? What the fuck? What? Everyone's gone bananas. Is it... Have we... Kind of like ascended. Um, did everyone else get like a tax rebate that we didn't get? Oh, so everyone's shit. feeling like flush with cash right oh now. God. Like, wow, that is bonkers. Bonkers um, brigade. Um, uh, holy shit, thank you. He asks, keep up the good work, lads. Are you interested in Underworlds Online? Seems like it might suck until they catch up with all the Shade Spire teams. Um, and they're releasing them in a different order. Um, keep an eye out for Tesla outside. But don't touch. Don't touch. Man, has he, got, he popped a Tesla outside. I wouldn't even know what. I wouldn't even recognize one. I'm not not a car guy. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't think Do you know what I mean? Like, I, like, I just go like, that looks like a fancy car. I mean, just because it's, you know, made in the last five years. <laughs> it doesn't look like my beat up old banger. But even then, like, I wouldn't, I don't know what, like, a good car is or a bad car. I don't really know anything about cars. Mm. Me neither. Um, but yeah, I'm excited for Underworlds Online because I really like Shakespeare. I think it's a great game, but I very rarely get to play it. Um, I haven't played it for like the last six months. So that that is something I could like just play for like a game or two in the evening, like because the board game only takes about thirty to forty minutes. Yeah. So I, online, you probably get it done in twenty. Yeah, I, can't, I like I really want to get into it, but in turn feel like oh fucking like behind on the meta and I just I can't be fucked mm. like it's like getting into a card game that's been running for a long time it's just like oh shit like where, where do you begin they're pretty chill on the releases they do like six teams and then nothing for like six months to a year and then another six teams like uh, in, they do it in like waves um, plus you know you can just net deck something that's good and then tweak it to fit your style rather than some style. Uh, okay. That's what I did anyway. I made an undead gang, found out, found just like a decent undead gang online and then like fiddled right. around, took out like no. half the cards so after I played a couple of games with it. Okay. Because uh, I don't have, I don't get to play enough to really experiment. Yeah, to like do loads of the tweaking. Hmm. Um, that, that makes sense. That makes sense. Like, for too long. Hmm. Um, Thanks, Johans. 
Yeah, holy shit. Thank you very much. Oh, so it's only releasing with four teams. Jeez. Really? That sounds fucking bad. Who's making it? I don't know. Is it fucking cyanide? <laughs> Are they going to make you pay for each team? Is it going to be like DLC I land? I bet it will be. Like they'll, 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 I bet they'll do it like Blood Bowl. Like it'll be like team packs or something. Mm. Um. Hopefully they keep... The thing is, like Games Workshop normally really bad for um, like erratas and FAQs and changing stuff. As it can, but Shadespire, they really every like three months they do a new. They they have a basically a restricted card list and a banned card. Yeah, list. that's that's one. And of they keep updating into it. it, or like the idea of it was um, because they were clearly some OP cards, and they did just immediately go, no, okay, we'll take those out. And they suck because they were in every deck. Yeah, which I, I like the idea of, and something like that is quite an easy tweak to make. You're not mm. changing the wording. Fuck, maybe a card like you know the next edition, mm. uh, like they've just next print run. Like, they just Beast Wars or whatever the fuck it's called came mm. out. If that comes with like some different cards, different versions of those old ones, they're like, okay, now these are in standard. Yeah. You want to play extended or hard mode, whatever they call it. But then with the computer version, it will just automatically update every time they do that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Going to have to eat them because we haven't actually taken the town yet. We have to still attack the town. Oh, shit. Um, yeah, we got a lot of... Um, no one died, though. A lot of people got very shot. Uh, there was a lot of shooting. Uh. A lot of shooting. Uh, going on. Oh, they've the orcs have attacked Krokar. We better help him. Do we? Yeah, I still think he might join us. I don't want to have to fight him. Uh, what melee attack? Melee defense. Yeah, let's go for attack with attack rather than defense. That's like a rule of thumb I do in. Um oh shit! Broccoli got wounded. Did he? I guess by an assassin. Hang on. What? Get out of the way. What, Did he get what shot? Was he in that? Bag? Yeah, no, no. This this prick came and got him. Oh, okay. Fuck. Yeah, because I was thinking like, man, I feel I thought I was being pretty careful with the injured units. Um, so who's nearly dead? <sighs> Pascal, you were very close to the bone. Yeah. Uh, Uncle Bulgaria's Birdos. Ah, uh, that that'll be fine. And uh, come on, Glapos, you catch up. Everyone else is <laughs> in gold. Come on, Glapos. More chopping, less slopping. Sloppy. Gonna sloppy. You should be choppy. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, case cage one. Um what was I saying? I've forgotten already. Kill them all. Uh you wanna confederate with him, you don't wanna go to war with him, maybe. Need to give out some of this crap. But it now means that we're at war with some orcs that I'm just worried that they're gonna just go bloop into the side of us in our northeastern territory. They're already they're here. Oh, okay. These, oh, fuck. These two boys feel like it's probably fine. I just don't want them just to like dip over the wall into the desert. Yeah, no, no that's true. Maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I shouldn't. Have. Um, we'll see. Um, uh, we need to take a break. Yeah, we track, do. Don't we? We do need to take a break. We also need to get through. Let's put down this rebellion. Need some Donato chomp. Um. But yeah, pal. Um, so we'll be, we're going to take a quick break. We'll be mm -hmm. back in sort of like five, five minutes or so. Have a pee. Mm -hmm. Have a drink. Not the same time. Uh, well, I will pee and you will drink. And then you will pee and I will drink. In separate rooms. I like, <laughs> like the claws. Almost had you, in. had you at the start there, didn't Just I? like, wait a second. I always have to do <laughs> it that way around. <laughs> Otherwise, we'll both be peeing at and the same time. And then suddenly you're never thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, one of my trademark changes of heart. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and so, yeah, we'll be, we'll be back in a few minutes. Um, you know, uh, what's the ads? Yeah. Pick out a thing. Um, or whatever. Not what your uh, mum do you like. Or, oh, go to the Warhammer forum and oh, join yeah. in the heated discussions about the Marvel comics. Um, oh, yeah, I bet some people have already lost their minds yeah. over it. I'm going to stop shopping at Games Workshop. <laughs> they ruined it. Like, whoa, whoa, easy there, Tiger. Yeah. Um, but They're not even made yet. They're already the best or worst thing that's ever happened <laughs> yeah. to me in my life. Like, guys, guys, come on. It's not, it is not the end of the world. Um, oh, bless we, <laughs> we'll, we'll, be, we'll be back in a minute. See you in five. <laughs>
Batman! Tom! Welcome, welcome back, everybody. Thanks, welcome man. back. Welcome back to you two. Thank you. We're doing, we're doing a game. We're playing the game. Uh, um, what's going on? I'm trying to spend, figure out how to spend the money to make... How do I make money into more money? I need to do that thing that rich people do. Ooh. Um, you know the one I mean? Ooh. Uh, uh, do you want to raise taxes? Just looking for territories that don't have a money house in. Okay. That's my plan. That sounds a lot like bed build, work. Build money house. That sounds like bed work. Um, ah. You, Kizaton. Uh, Tumble Tim has donated. And they say, Swiss Family Robinson Crusoe Tom mm. and Satan from Time Bandits Ben. <laughs> <laughs> what was Satan I like in Time Bandits? I can't remember. I, I kind of don't. Was he fabulous? I, I, I can only imagine so. Um, Satan usually is quite fabulous in things. Uh, very diligent. Um, you sons of bitches have made me addicted to this game. Oh, no, we did it. Uh, and pushed me into the trap of sculpting RPG miniatures. Holy shit. Wow. That's pretty good. That classic trap. Um, ooh. Uh, I will say it's cathartic, though. Cath cathartic. That's how you say it. Cathartic, though. Uh, so, thank you. Love you. But also, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I like that. <laughs> that, like, level of, um, uh, you know, there's a bit of, a bit of uh, nice, a bit of... Yeah. Meanness, the old. I can respect that. Spank and tickle. Uh, thank you, Tom Uh <laughs> And the wastrel donates, and they say, "Turn bomb." Hey, boys. Uh, Vod Goblin Logistics Manager here. Oh. Uh, <laughs> to thank you for your weekly donation to the pile. Uh, also, are either of you playing Magic: The Gathering Arena? Hmm. Uh, I never played it before, but I like it online. Seems like something you would enjoy. Yeah, but I played a little bit of it recently. Because um, Lewis and I played loads like a year ago. Uh, we put a load on the Lewis and Ben channel. Well, you didn't, you didn't grab. Oh. Um, but yeah, they just did. They just uh, launched out of beta last week. Oh shit! Nice. And it's quite fun, especially like the draft games, because it's hard to compete in the ranked mode because there's always someone with a fucking amazing deck. Oh shit! You know, you either spend a lot of money to compete, or you build one deck that you can afford with your what you've got right okay. but if you play draft then you can win you win more than you pay to go in okay oh i like profiting. that and you it's a level playing field because everyone is drafting they're not no one's using their collection okay that's my favorite mode um yeah i was curious to get to give it a try like i like magic hmm. Ooh. Oh shit, they are just focusing tic-tac-toe. Fuck, I thought he'd be all right. Oof. Um, I'm hoping for the giga drop. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh. oh! Look at the power bar at the top. Can you, does it say casualties? Enemy troop count. They've got 235 out of the 748 they started with. We just 500 elves in that single... Oh, my God. Giga drop. Oh, round two. Boom, 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 boom. So those are like the bad bombs. <laughs> You're going to kill another 100. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, right. I'm now just going to tell them just to, like, fucking die. Oh, don't, don't melee. Just javelin, right? they got javelins. Oh, yeah, shit. Oh, but yeah, you're right. Uh, we still actually have some bombs. I guess they'll go and blow up there, haven't they? Send the Lord in now. They've got no archers left. Uh, wows. That's, that's our most effective bombing yet. That was, that was something special. Yeah, I tried line, like having them in a big line. I just told them to maneuver <laughs> and be on the... Um, castle. Oh, shit, it's just a person. Just a Lord. Oh, fuck, when I was looking from back here, I thought it was a ranked up unit. But then again, you know, I've got bad eyes. So. Oh man, that was distracting. Um, thanks, Master. We got uh, Double Door, donated fifteen dollars. It says, "Thank you very much." I'm excited for the end potentially being in Total War Three, just because I read a story sometime that I dug up about people there worshiping Tiger Beastmen despite being eaten by them. Yeah, Tiger Beastmen. I always yeah. thought that was a fun idea. That is cool. The, and then like, they sort of worship them as like 
the met the like in manifestation of their gods. Yeah, yeah, because like chaos creatures are supposed to be sort of um, the based on like well, um, whatever the local local animals are. Yeah, yeah, like that that sort of. Um, Sort of idea and like what people are kind of scared of. I think you run you you're getting into furry territory though. Mm. You'd have to design those, yeah, quite specifically to not yeah, look like not, furries. Not super, super sold, but mm. like inns, inns kind of cool. Like it's one of those things. Like we know so little about them that like you just kind of have to imagine generic fantasy Indian. Yeah, stuff, elephants maybe. Um, the same with like Nippon. Because, um, mm. like, cafe is the same, but it's had, like, that tiny little bit more addition. Like, there's some yeah. nods to it in, like, the Ogre books because, uh, was best the, like, there's a lot of, like, trade going on. Cetra yeah. and Lonely Snow tied for best birdos. Pow, man, those guys fucking nailed it. Good job. Um, and... Like when they, they when they talk about cafe, mm. they're like, you know, the whatever the fucking main cafe in city is, mm -hmm. is just meant to be like, the, like just the biggest city in the world. Yeah, like it's like a giga. Anything compared to, like nothing in the old world, even comes close to. Like yeah, there's like millions of people. Like millions and millions in this like ever ending. Because it's just it's like a, an exaggeration, a comic, like a. Yeah, an exaggeration of like uh, China. So everything China does, it's like a more, more version. Um, and so, like, kind of curious. And they have, um, what are they called? The Celestial Dragon Monks. Oh, yeah, um, I forgot about Which that. I was like the sound of. Yeah, they're basically like um, Kung Fu warrior priests. Yeah, the, um, I oh. picture a bit like sort of people from Avatar, not the, not the Na'vi. The Avatar: The Last Airbender. Oh right, I guess what the Space Marines? Like, what, <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> they, like they're sort of you know badass martial artists, but they breathe fire. They have elemental powers, like all that just like wacky, wacky stuff. Um, although I want Araby first, because Araby, there was a War Master army. There was, yeah, they had Araby. like uh, genies and shit. Yeah, and uh, they had magic carpets. Yep, of course. They were stupid. All the tropes. I think uh, they had elephants as well, right? I can't remember if they had. They must have had elephants. Yeah, with like um, like howders. Uh, but also they had camels, and I've got mm. a real soft spot for <laughs> like camel riders. <laughs> so derpy. They're just kind of goofy. Like camels are just real goofy, goofy guys. They are um, weird looking creatures. Uh, just real, real dumb. So get them in. Get them all in. Why not? Why not? More, more, more things, more good. Oh shit, we are getting raided by goblins. You were fucking right, Tom. You were right. I never should have done it. I regret everything. You're the best. I'm the worst. Um. Uh, Smirgledwerf has donated, and they say, uh, Tom, Bem, Smirgledwerf, uh, you should confederate with Krokgar and make oh, him the explorer source as punishment for failing so we've miserably. We've been trying. He's just an yeah. asshole. He just, he just don't trust us. Wait, is he the asshole or were we the assholes? We were the assholes to the wood elves. He should get over that. Yeah, like we fucked over some people who were like invading our lands. Like we're doing this for the better of like lizard mankind. Yeah, that's it. We're all lizards together, Grokka. Come on. And it's weird that he'd be like, no, the ends do not justify the means. <laughs> yeah. uh, like they were fucking elves. You're like the last offender. You're this like radical psychosaurus. Why are you angry that we yeah. we he's, killed some elves? He's like the the fucking nationalist terrorist of the lizard men, isn't yeah. he? <laughs> and, no, guys, you're too extreme. <laughs> you went for too us. far. Wow, fucking hell! Just you know, chill out, chill out, you big uh, big dino nerd. Uh, <laughs> But yeah, yeah, if we can get him in. Although I kind of think we're just going to stone cold kill him. Um, yeah, probably. Depends how long it takes us to kill all these elves. Ooh, shit! Fuck me. Fauna who, here who is coming. Who are they? What's that good? It's the same guys. No, these guys. Oh, Shadow oh, Warriors. Shadow Warriors, fuck. Fuck, oh my god, this army. Swordmasters, laser bows. 
Shadow Warriors? Honestly, no idea how good they are. But no. Dragon Princes are pretty fucking stone cold killers. And we don't have any friends here yet. Uh, um, Rut Ru Row indeed. Can we, um. Have peace. Oh, we've got no money. I was going to say Recruit Lord. A classic. Classic us. Classic, classic us. us. Emergency Lord deployment. No money. Um, uh, that's Tempora. Do you 20 bucks? Holy shit. Thank you. Um, they say Tom Lander, Ben Lander, Warhammers. Um, last week, I asked if you watched Star Wreck mm. in The Perkening. Uh, did you watch it? No, I read the Wikipedia article after the stream uh -huh. and then didn't get around to watching it. Um, uh, mainly because my partner, who I basically, if, if she's not into something, I don't usually don't watch it because the time I watch TV is the time you're watching stuff together. Stuff with, together so she doesn't like know about Star Trek or anything. Oh, shit. So, yeah, I, I don't. Yeah, I didn't watch it. I don't have anyone to watch it I with. I don't think I'd get any of the jokes. But I want to at some point. If I'm ever like home alone and painting, I'll put it on. Although, is it subtitled? Because then I can't paint and watch it. So that might be a problem. Oh, fuck Tom. Look. There's two of them now. Get a head biter. We're going to lose okay. Kasabar. Fuck. It's okay. We'll kill them. We'll kill them all, Ben. Uh, well, thank you for the temporary. Not just the goblins, but the vodlings too. <laughs> they killed the goblins and the vodlings. Uh, Blue Zarp donates and they say, Hiya, Ben and Tom. Blue Zarp. Um, I'm glad to catch the stream again. This is uh, well theme tune. Blue Zarp. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it sounds like like a cleaning product. <laughs> yeah. Blues up. up. <laughs> yeah, it does. Uh, can I get a unit named after me? Uh, we shall try our best to hold the line, slash break the enemy, slash or die bravely. Um, we ask nothing more than that. It's going to be one of those. Um, sometimes it's not even bright day, die bravely. It's just get auto-resolved. Oh, I've got um, these to name. The Recru Umbral Tide. Yeah, okay, special gonna... Scallymanders. I'm just going to go basically at random through here. Um, right, Hip Lemming, you're in. You got it. Boom, Hip Lemming, you're the special Scallies. Uh, Indie Wolf 1 donates, and they say, Tom, thanks for finishing The Sinking City. Uh, looking forward to Dark Souls 3 with Harry, if you guys keep going. Any word on another Yogg's Quest? Um, not uh, entirely yet, although we've been planning... We're doing it. We're going to start doing a role-playing podcast mm -hmm. thing, which will be a bit like Yogg's Quest, but it won't be Yogg's Quest. Mm -hmm. um, and talking about the the Jingle Jam, that we might do a Yogg's Quest then, but not entirely sure yet. Mm -hmm. um, there is a uh, Call of Cthulhu scenario that I really want to run, mm -hmm. um, but whether or not we do do that or not, I don't know. Um, yeah, it's tricky. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Um, uh, Futurama Evil Santa themed Yoz Quest. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. That could work. Uh, going around. Um, like, I've read, like, a whole load of... Because I really like reading just, like, stupid one-shots that people write. Yeah. And I've read, like, a whole load of, like, Christmas-themed one-shots. And there are, like, even, like, Warhammer Fantasy roleplay ones. Wow. Of, you know, like a evil chaos guy going around delivering like basically doing the nightmare before Christmas right. and he goes around and gives evil toys to people. <laughs> sure. That sort of sort of thing. Um, so I think, you know, you could do we could do one. Um, Possible. Uh, ben, build the plus 10% money houses in all his towns. Well, well, that would require slots. That's the problem. Costs a lot of money to get a slot. We got no slots. Uh, like, over here. No slots. I've got this one. I've got it in the capital. Um, but it requires tier three and a slot. Most of our places are not tier three. Fuck. Uh, look, like this one, bam, not tier three. Wow. This one that was needs a slot. Tier two. Don't have a slot. Down here, uh, not tier three yet. Do you know what I mean? Like, I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying. You're doing great, Ben. But also, like, you need, um, you need a pretty decent income before that building's worth building. Do you know what I mean? You've got to get all the little incomes in first and then percent them. There's no point in doing 10% of 100. You want to do 10% of 1,000. Boom. I'll just defer to Ben on the, <laughs> <laughs> the you know. Right, I've got a battle for you, Tom. The elves have landed on the oh. beaches. We can get them. 
Fuck me. You've got, look, you've got this wave of expendable troops. Ooh, hello. Get them up first. I think I know who's going to be shot. Krokgar's got some skink, like two skinks here. <laughs> some Saurus. Okay. Randomly. Um, well, fuck. Oh, man. I like it when the AI turns up. I wish more, that happened more. Mm, it's really rare. Uh, I, I really... I think that just should happen way more. I f if that did happen a lot more, you could suddenly really change a lot of aspects of the game. Suddenly having small armies, but suddenly you and yeah. soft allies joining together, and you having to deal with the garbage AI... Because you can here. tell the AI to attack certain places, but it, it either doesn't do it, or it does it just with the worst stuff at the yeah. wrong time. Like, it never does it well. Like, if you could just do something of like, oh, you have... I'm going to join up with Krokgar to attack the elves. Do something where his army basically gets bolted onto yours for five turns. Mm. And until you leave their territory, his army will stay with you, guaranteeing that you guys will do a fight together. Something like that would be absolutely awesome. Um, and it means that you could get away with, yeah, like these little forces kind of working together. But Yeah, that sounds cool. I as idea of that. Nothing like that exists. And you don't get these kind of like big cool alliance fights or stuff like that. What are these guys? Little They're, shoot um, them. Short range shooting, but they uh, do a big explosive shooting. It's quite quite empty. Okay. Um, and they're not bad in melee either. Right. Okay, I just kind of want to like... Wait for the... Fuck, I might meet have to pull back up. real far. Uh, yeah, that's probably okay. Uh, Tuna Turner donates. Tuna Turner? Says, Bomb tent! Hey! I just started uni and have Wednesdays free, so I can catch this and the Pokemon stream for a double dose of death. Blam, that is a good a good power combo. Perfect. Can you name something that will be cut down desperately fleeing from glorious battle? Thanks so much for being funny. Uh you could be this unit of elves. <laughs> okay. We're gonna get some recruitment in, in a minute. Um we just haven't had the money. And uh, Jinjanjina. Jinja Ninja. <laughs> Actually that makes more sense. <laughs> Jinjanjina. <laughs> like Jinjanjina. It's funny because it does spell that if you read, you know, if you put the emphasis and the gaps in different places. Yeah, fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Ginger Ninjas donates fifteen dollars. Thank you, and says, um, "Ben, Tom, my first time donating. Thanks for taking my virginity. Ooh. I'm from Cincinnati, and I remember as a kid seeing my favourite boy Harambe whenever we went to the zoo on that fateful until that fateful day. Oh, fuck. Let him live on as a big chonker in your army." Oh, I'd love to have Harambe. Oh my God, in the Harambe as a giant dino would be amazing, but we are quite far off recruiting giant dinos unless we get given one for a quest. I don't know if we can make it happen. Suicide Force Five Thousand. Okay, I'm worried. Krokgar is like, I'm trying to organize my army. Krokgar is going fucking ham already. Is he just footballing it in? He is super, super going for it. Um, Ospon donates. Says evening boyos yeah, with a up? unit. Who Ospon. knows? Maybe I'll be useful this time. Oh, well, maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Uh, Flatopus is donated $10 and says, Ben, Tom, would you like to live in a world like Hellboy, where it's the modern world but with weird fantasy elements? Yeah. P.S. Can I be something we can use as thanks? Yeah, holy shit, man. I'd fucking love that. I really, I really, really like that. I feel like if you grew up in that world, you wouldn't know that it was magic and weird and you just take it for granted and everything would be normal. I th so I think it's the, that sort of thing of like, to you, that stuff isn't magic and weird, but with the idea of, okay, there is this like, hidden world behind the veil that not oh, everyone okay, knows yeah. about. And so you can be like, this stuff is bleeding into the um, the real world. Yeah, that makes more sense. Um, and I, a bit like we were talking about with um, the sort of like, uh, you know, the Victoriana style setting. Mm -hmm. um, Jeez, I've got a real fucking defensive hill there, haven't I? Yeah, but luckily we have the Suicide Force. <laughs> suicide Squad going <laughs> Sorry, guys. You are going to have a fucking horrible day. We could do the try and get the Giga line. and Yeah, yeah, do it. Giga line. Giga line. No, okay. That, you just oh. told them to attack. Get, get TikTok on something as well. He's got two big bombs now. Yeah, I like. Three to, big bombs. I kind of like to keep him back a little bit right, so because they will head. alpha strike him to shit. Uh, okay, this is quite a big battle to control. Yeah, there's a lot of there's a lot of a lot of wheels turning, Ben. 
Uh, luckily, they're shooting the nerds. Croc Gar's going in. What a what a dum dum. Um. Uh, Geordie Third says, "What's your favourite unit in Warhammer 2? Or favourites per faction? I love the Warhammer streams. Thanks, Geordie. I love you too." Um, oh, oh, the skirmishing. Fuck. Oh, okay, right. Ruined. You might have to take a couple of arrows, and some people can get bitten by birds, but don't fucking worry. Get in there, so you bird nerd. One. Oh, fuck. I kind of just want everyone to be there. Oh, shit. Why can't we do it? Uh, someone's engaged in combat. Fuck. Okay, it, it, I can see which one it is. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck. Okay, this is not going not super well. Oh. I thought that was going to be. That's okay, we're gonna have to, just have to play the game now. <laughs> 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 oh, uh, favorite units? Uh, the thing is, my favorite units are always what looks cool and what I like in the lore. Like, I actually don't know, understand, or care about the stats in this as much. So there's probably far more effective units. And often the units I like, I'm like, why isn't this unit doing better? Because you know, because it's garbage and I don't put its stats. Yeah, that's why they they just make it up. Um, right, okay, Suicide Brigade, actually kind of living a bit. Yeah, yeah, they need to get in there. Um, this hill is so good with the river in front of it oh, as well. Right. It's fucking horrible. I really like the Tomb Scorpion for the... Um, that thing looks amazing. The Kemri, like its animations look fantastic. The way yeah. it kind of like pops out of the sand and then like rips into units and drags people under the sand with it and stuff. Yeah, that's that's very cool. I like that a lot. I 100% agree. Um, yeah, and I like the, I just like the idea of the Tomb Scorpion as well. Mm. Like a cool dude. I like warp fire throwers for Skaven. They're, they're terrible, but they sh they should be good. <laughs> uh, Wish they were better. Rattling guns. Um, I loved them in the tabletop when they <laughs> yeah. first came out. I was like, that name is so stupid. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. And they were so much fun, and they're kind of fun in this. But just watching rattling guns just open up. Yeah, on it people looks amazing. Is very satisfying. pretty cool. I like the, um, uh, the, what's it, the Grail Knight Requillery. That thing is awesome. The little boys with the with the dead man on a horse going clippity clop, clippity clop. They run a lot. Such cool design. <laughs> yeah. It's fantastic. 100%. I agree. Um, very, very into that. So, yeah, that's our top three, Geordie. Uh, yeah. Thanks, man. Tick your pick. Um, Diamond Boots has donated $12 and says, Ton Neb. Nebmot, Vodgob here, assembling a team of villainous villains to take down the Avengers. So give me your favorite, dumb, cool, whatever, rude dudes, and I'll add them to the terrible Photoshop of the team I'll do. Uh, the stuff to you in the bot. Mm. Um, our favorite what's? I think just villains. Favorite villains of all time. Villains of all time? Uh, he wants to take down the Avengers. Uh, oh. He wants the dumbest, dumbest, coolest, uh, Squad okay. of boys. Um, Martian, Martian tripods from War of the Worlds. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, I always liked all of Spider-Man's villains. I always thought they were dumb. And, uh, yeah, they're all like kind of goofy and kind of fun. Um, um, Mysterio, he's a classic. Mysterio, just yeah, he's one of my favorite Spider-Man characters in general. In um, did I ever tell you like in the Old Man Logan comic, where it's like. 40 years in the future and all the heroes are dead and the villains have taken over the world. Um, spoiler alert, mute this for 30 seconds if you don't know what happens because it's a good comic. But um, at the end it turns out, like they never really explain how it happens uh, until the end. And then right at the end they, they, they reveal that um, the villains decided to all get together and swapped which villains fought which goodies. So they got like the Fantastic Four guys to go fight the Avengers and then right. um, Spider-Man's villains are went for the X-Men and they all just rotated around so none of them knew how to deal with them yeah <laughs> and Mysterio just turned up at Professor X's mansion and put illusions for Wolverine only that all the other X-Men were people invading Professor X's mansion fuck me that's so Wolverine knifed every member of the X-Men to death wow <laughs> while Mysterio stood there and as soon as he'd finished he like went oh okay illusion removed and then Wolverine just had like a complete fucking mental breakdown yeah 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 that is Oh, I like it. It's pretty <laughs> fucking dark. <laughs> it's pretty fucking dark. Uh, but, yeah, holy shit. You know, that's, that's a good strap. You know, get your enemies to kill kill each other. Mm. Okay, right. 
This has actually been kind of fucking savage. Man, that hill was brutal. They really got good shooting on us. We've kind of broken the most of them, but... So good. And Suicide Force didn't actually take as many casualties. No, because they ran up to the river and the hill and went, oh, can't get up this way. Yeah. <laughs> and it turned out to be like the second wave. Yeah, I was hoping that they'd get shot more. Um. Okay, yeah, we'll just, we'll just end it. I don't want to chase anything down. I can't be bothered. Um. Oh, man. You did gut them. Oh, we lost a lot of our Saurus, though. Yeah. I guess, yeah, Swordmaster's pretty good against Saurus. Pretty good, and they just got shot a lot. Just got really shot, man. Tic-Tac-Toe got shot a lot as well. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Shit. Ripperoni, Glapos, Snooze of Oh, Ooh. Ben, also. Pascal, Rufus. Glapos just leveled up. Oh, he did! Glapos, we told him! Are you not proud of me, <laughs> man? I did it on rank <laughs> 7! I'm not proud of me! I did what you asked of his, me! His dying breath. Oh. And you come over and just pin the, the medal I on I pin him. the medal on <laughs> the corpse. And bam! <laughs> yikes. 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 Rip all those boys. Rufus as well. Uh. You've done good. I mean, you got to rank 7. <laughs> Shit, me. <laughs> who, who done best out of the, the alive boys? Salamanders did good, these new boys. Um, okay, Fleming. Uh, Fleming, 29 kills. I like. I just kind of clicked around with them. I wasn't really um, moving them into good positions. Fuck me, that unit sword master is 214 kills. <gasps> they earned some fucking... Shit me, they really killed a lot of Saurus. Because we don't even have that many easy to kill stuff in no. there. And we didn't lose many skinks. Fuck about. Um, just take the heal because we need to finish them off. Push them into the sea, boys! Yeah. Push them into the sea. Elsa's. Yeah, for sure. Well, uh, you know, money's looking alright. Money is looking alright. Money's looking alright. Maybe we can get some recruitment in next That's time. not bad. Uh, shall I give him 10% magic resist uh, missile resistance? Oh no, I wouldn't want a skink commander. I've got a plan, Tom. Mm -hmm. All these generous but don't know boys mm -hmm. can form the elite squadron of three skink chiefs on pterodons. Ooh, hello there. <laughs> we'll fly around together. Hello there. Wow, the, like the aces. The ace squadron. Oh my god. But I need to get Tic Tac Toe to somewhere where he can recruit skink chiefs because he gives them plus four rank. Okay. And then he can fly around with like the damn. How many, how many skink chief slots do we have? Uh, where can we make them? Let's place with skink chiefs. Um, can we recruit that many? We can get them here. Uh, so we can have three. We've already got one, so we can have two more. Okay. Um, where's the nearest one? That's a Saurus house. Uh, you have here it is. Keep around. He's a town. Okay, we need to get him back to here. March him. <coughs> and then we'll form the, the amazing flying squadron. In like two turns. Uh, right. Um, Trailing Badger's donated. And they say, uh, Ba weep, grana weep, nini bong. Yep, universal greeting. Uh, Tom and Ben. My pals are sick, so cancel tonight's Rangers of the Shadow Deep game. Oh. Uh, but that just means spending time with the best nerds, EU, and hobby. Hello. Hello. Uh, P.S. I bought a new PC. So I might actually play this game. Oh, social life. Yep, rip. Holy shit! Jump on in, make it, make it happen. You know, play some Warhams. Yeah, yeah. Um, although I'm always worried about like if people play a lot of this game as well, oh, then they'll not want to watch us play it badly. Yeah, because suddenly they realise <laughs> we don't know what we're doing. We've got no idea what the fuck is going on. Uh, we just want birds. We just click around and <laughs> look at me. I'm playing a game. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Oof. Uh, okay, our Skink Chief's back. That's good. Broccoli's here. Nice. Uh, he'll just have to chase, chase the boys. Um, uh, oh, um, shit. Does he want to go over and scout out Elfland? Oh, yeah, he probably should, shouldn't he? And find out what those fucking elf elf nerds are doing. Because um, I, don't, I don't want them. I don't want them in my life. No, we need to... Shit, Grotkar's losing to the elves. 
Look. I've taken um, Serpent that's, Coast. That's good, then. <laughs> that's yeah, good. That's true. That is Because either he's weaker and easier for us to conquer, or he's weaker and he's easier to confederate with. <laughs> yeah. It's true. Should we try that again? We I'm fine with Very this. low. Oh, look at his act. Like, no, he won't. Man, we've got... He really, he really likes us, but just doesn't trust us. Trust us. Uh, sad times. Um, uh, <laughs> uh, Dumpster Queen donates twenty bucks and says, "Right, Batering Transformer Lady Tron forty thousand reporting in." Man, that is an amazing name. <laughs> I want to have a. It might be a bit long, but Lady Tron forty thousand <laughs> Vibrator Tron. Um, what more do you need, pal? Does exactly what it says on the tin. Exactly <laughs> on the packaging, I guess. Uh, thank you very much. Wow. Um, and Lexapi donates, and they say, uh, Tom and Jerry and Ben and Jerry. <laughs> 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 very good. That's, uh, that's, some, that's some good wordplay. Uh, Vod Goblin here. Uh, instead of having a unit or location, uh, can you name your currency after me? Oh. Uh, incidentally, I have no idea how to pronounce this username. <laughs> but I see that more as your problem now than mine. Um, we will do this for as Lexapi? long as we remember. Lexapi. Uh, yeah, I just thought like Lexapi. Lexapis. Lexapi. Okay, we've got 8,000 Lexapis. <laughs> so, well, we've got 10,000 Lexapis now. 10,000 Lexapi. We're making 2,100 Lexapi a turn. Oh, we've just met everyone in the world. Hang on, let me get my trade on. Okay, who um, who's number one? I, I always want to know who number one is. Oh, yeah, do that too. Who's number one? I don't know. Not a major pack faction with a port, apparently. Ooh. Place your bets <laughs> now. I don't even know um, who number two is. Shit, we weird. were number two. Yeah, we're four now. Oh, who's number one? Orcs. It can't be orcs. Chaos, chaos aren't. Don't have like a proper faction. No, because we're playing um, Isle of Vortex. Lizards. But. Could be Mazdo, but Mazdo's got a big port. Uh, Mazdo, he's got a lot of coast. Yeah. And the elves are. Pirates? Could, no, all the pirates have coast. They're fucking They're boat boys. Nagaron. Nagaron often gets one. Nakai. Nakai could have fucking been stomping, but. Could, be, could be Nakai. It might be two. But dwarves, there's not a big enough dwarf faction. They're all like um, uh, B lists. Like, mm. B-list dwarf celebrities hanging out. Um. Okay, we've got an arrogant boy and a weapon master boy. So who are these going to be? Okay. Um, got like a bunch of... Well, I'm just going to make them both absolute killers. The super, well, the super I mean, kill. They say points. killers, but I mean, I'm just going to buff their combat stats is what I mean. Um, and I'm going to give them all magic shit. Um, okay, so who's the first? Uh, I guess that could be Chiron. They were in, in the start. Bam. Chiron. Um, Boom. That's it. Thank you You're very the much. weapon master, Bird Boy. And then Bird Boy number two. Uh, um, you get Dance of Death, some shots, and I give you... Uh, Are we going to get something big and stompy? Is that, a, is that an option? Only if we get a quest. Oh, fuck. Okay. Um... Because we don't have the building for it. Uh, well, Hammerfee said, or just a skink. So this is a skink, but they're a special bird skink. Yeah, you're, you're part of, of the doom. What are we going to call this elite squadron of bird boys? Oh. Uh, where's the other priest? Is he in the other army? Oh, yeah, he's up here, the chieftain. Like whoop whoop whoops up here. We need to bring him down and squadronize them. The Mighty Ducks, I like the Skink Squad, that's fucking good. The Death Squadron. The Mighty Ducks, is there like a better duck pun? I want, I want, I like something along those lines. Birds of play. Birds of play, <laughs> point beak. <laughs> point beak! <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Because like there's, I feel like there's like a pun in there somewhere, um, of you know, like in Star Wars with um, 
when they're like, you know, red, red one, so yeah. red two, you could have like red crest oh. one, red <laughs> crest two. <laughs> red crest squadron. Um, sure. I, I've also got a squadron of um, legendary Ripodactyls that need a name. Legendary Ripodactyls? Pow. Okay. Um, uh, Empiodge, you're in. That's a, that's a very special boy. You made it. You made it. Uh, do we have any like towns and shit to name? Oh yeah, loads. Do, do, like, uh, you know, we can run the gamble. Does does people want to be towns? I can put some towns in. Do you need to go through and name a couple of towns? Yeah. Like, let me um, start at the beginning and work my way around. Um, Denise. Is is Casabar? Oh yeah, no, Casabar's part. Like that needs a renaming. It can be. Uh, <laughs> Car Tumbletim. Port Tumbletim. You uh, currently have an, a minor orc infestation, but um. All right, the big dinos are there to chase them out. Okay, we got this place. Um, they could be Vata Tempora. Vata Tempora Bay. Boom. And we've got the Temple of Gold. The Temple of Gold, Double Door. If you're in. The Temple of Durpledor. Very nice. Durpledor. Run out of space. Uh, I'll spawn the tree. We've got that. Um, what are we going to build here? Money house? Um, question mark? Uh, maybe the... the percent house? I've been told off about that. Uh, but why are you playing the game wrong? Playing it wrong, man. Uh, uh, so right, the Caverns of Sotek, that needs a name. The Caverns of Sotek? Can that be the Caverns of Vro Bratering Transformer Ladytron 40,000? Uh, VT <laughs> LO 40K, sure. I mean, I assume you mean that <laughs> standard <laughs> abbreviation. Oh, yeah, yeah. VTL 40K. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's exactly what I meant. <laughs> that's. That's the serial number that you read out. That's uh, VTL four zero K. Why aren't you at your post? <laughs> uh, <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm in. I'm sold. Very good. Very strong. And this one? Uh, that can be um, Ospon. Ospon something. Tor Ospon. Tor Ospon. And then we've got this territory over here. Scrag Hole. Scrag Hole. It's definitely not named after anyone. <laughs> that can be uh, the Ginger Ninja Hole. You're in. You're in. And uh, Dawn's Light. Uh, Dawn's Light. That could be Dr. Cabrant's Light. Uh, I kind of just like pull pull at random from the list as. There's too many. There's, 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 a, lot of, there's a lot of boys. Uh, right. Um, so uh, Clacking is also donated. They donated clacking. 15 bucks. Oh. Thank you very much, Clacking. Clacking. Uh, What's well, Clacking 6? Mm. Not to be confused with the other inferior clackings. No, he's uh, his most up-to-date model. Uh, yeah, exactly. Um, and they say, good to see my basic bird boys doing good. Keep up the good times. Thank you, Clacking. Thanks, Clacking. That's very kind. That's very nice. Um, and uh, Trout 1066. That's just some bits. Uh, 1,500 bits. Ooh, Ooh thank you. Uh, and they say, Tom, Ben, uh, I wanted to ask the best lore masters, who do you think has it worst off? The Gene Seed Pool Lamenters, perhaps? Hmm. Who has it worst off on the Gene Seed Pool? All right, so which Space Marines have got like, the most defunct, retarded Gene Seed? Um. Um. I think the Space Wolves have got it pretty bad. Oh, because they're furries. Because they turn into furries, yeah. They th uh, they like to think they're the cool Vikings, but they're not. They're furries, they're furries. in disguise. Furries in disguise. <laughs> um, I also think blood angels, because they're like, oh, I'm a vampire. Oh, I drink blood. I wear a robe. I'm a vampire. Mm. I'm angry. Night. Sometimes when I go really angry, I have to wear black with big red X's on. <laughs> yeah. Arr, do not play with us. <laughs> We're very angry. Um, yeah, fuck. Like, yeah. I don't know. Like, I'm not as super balls deep in my Space Marine Gene Seed lore. Um, yeah. Like, I don't know what the 
the bad part of the Gene Seeders with like the Iron Hands? Do they have a lot of them? Actually, don't have any falls at all. Oh, okay. Oh, I thought um, they all had. No, like the Ultramarines obviously don't, and um, anyone who comes off of the Ultramarines generally doesn't. Right. Okay. It's like the most stable. Dark Angels don't have any. Um, the Imperial Fists are really janky. Like they don't have. They've been missing like three organs that oh. the others have. Like they can't spit acid. <laughs> And they can't um, do that hibernation thing. Where they go into stasis. <laughs> they like make like a little wax <laughs> cocoon. <laughs> yeah. I've, you know what? I'm kind of I'm kind of happy for them because I reckon give it like a couple of years, no one is going to have that gene sequence. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> no one's going to have that thing. They're going to phase that out of the and law. And suddenly they're they? sat there like, hmm. So you can't spit acid now, can you? <laughs> that thing that has basically never turned up ever, <laughs> yeah. and most people just completely ignore uh, because. It's really dumb. It's so it's dumb. It's really weird. It's very 80s. <laughs> it's so 80s. And, uh, yeah. Oh, apparently. The Imperial Fist can do the cocoon thing, Ben. They definitely can't. Ooh. Ooh. Let's say they might have retconned it. Ooh. They didn't used to be able to do it. Maybe they can now. I don't know. <sighs> like, does it matter? Doesn't matter. Does it matter? Don't worry about it. Um... Some one of them can't do that. Um, eat the brains and get the memories thing. <laughs> Space Marines have so that, many fucking weird so, abilities. Oh, that is such like an eighties one. I remember that, like, because a lot of these I don't really pay attention to because it never really it ever doesn't comes up, come up. <laughs> ever. Yeah. Because oh. like back then it was like, oh, the Space Marines they're a bit fucking wackier, um, and. They all had like kind of slightly sillier haircuts and stuff like that, and were a lot more weird. Whereas now, I feel like the space marines are a lot more sterile than they were. Mm. And I guess they don't really want, you know, your space marines, the good guys, the ultra marines. You can't picture him like eating someone's brain <laughs> and being like, mm. <laughs> "Yes, <laughs> we know where they are ah, now." The key, the passcode for the door. It's oh no, no, <laughs> like that doesn't. <laughs> That, that feels so good. out of like whack with all of the other like mechanics of just what they do now. Yeah. Yeah. Forty K lore is fun. Um, the Iron Hands floor is their stubborn to a fault. Yeah, but they, it's not. It's not part of their gene seed. That's just like their doctrine. And they don't give a shit about civilians. Yeah. Like I really like um. I like the Iron Hands. I think they're cool. Cause like I remember reading something somewhere that like they're often the chapter when there has to be sort of like not quite an exterminatus but they're like chaos has been here we got to do like a bit of a, a bit, bit of cleansing, cleansing. <laughs> yeah. um, and like where they go to a hive and they kill like one in three people uh, like two and three people Oof. just to like just to be thin sure. down the numbers make sure everyone is like they make us come back. <laughs> yeah. And they're like, okay, who's going to do this? And the Iron Hands are always like, I will do it! <laughs> the flesh is weak! The flesh is weak! <laughs> because they're just like, fuck it. We'll, we'll do that job. And everyone's like, ooh, do we want to do it? And they're like, mm. let me do it! <laughs> yeah. um, nice. Like, I feel like their, their flaws should have been like, you know, like they get like 40k leprosy or something. Something that explains why they want to keep like replacing their body with with stuff. It's know. obvious. The flesh is weak. The flesh is weak. But, you know... Maybe their flesh should be actually weak. Make it actually weak. Like, actually, you know, give it, like, a flaw. And so they do it, and they're, to everyone, like, boom. Although maybe that devalues it, because if I'm, like, oh, Ben, eyes are terrible. Eyes are the worst. That's mm. why I put glasses on. And you're like, well, it's no, because it's, your eyes are bad. And that's why you're saying you should wear glasses. Because <laughs> yeah. you have to wear glasses. And suddenly if their bits are falling off, they have to get mecha, mecha bits. Oh, yeah, then it's less of a choice, isn't it? Yeah. Or just like, uh, well, like, what else to, are you going to do? They have to, have to do that. Um, but, yeah. So, I guess, yeah, like space, space furries, they're probably, they probably have the hard, mm. hardest time. Is that, but there's a whole bunch of the, the cursed founding. There's like a million chapters who were made from mushing all the different gene seeds together to make supermarines. Oh, and, and they that. all came out wrong. And like the black dragons have like big spur, bo bony spurs coming out of all their joints. And um, 
the flame falcons, I think, like spontaneously combust for no reason. <laughs> That's a bad one. <laughs> Pretty <laughs> bad. <laughs> you spun, spun bad on that wheel. Yeah. <laughs> fucking self-immolation. Um, uh, can't remember half of them. A bunch of them just had to be like exterminated. Yeah, see for heresy. Yeah, see. <laughs> see. S sixty in chat's like, <laughs> I'm fucking on fire, brother. <laughs> I'm on fucking fire, brother. <laughs> <laughs> fire. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's not a good one. <sighs> that's a bad. That's a bad time. Yikes. Well, yeah, I don't think I'd want big spikes out of my knees and elbows. No, and you know, where else do they have spikes? You know, Ooh. it might not just be that. Fuck, that was a really good set of villains in one of the um. Batman of Batman. the Future animations. That animated cartoon. I used to quite like that animated Batman cartoon of the when I was a kid. I never Batman really watched it. it I know cool. everyone loved it. Like, it's well received. Um, and there was this gang of, like, four dudes who wanted to be, like, crims. Mm -hmm. And there was this, like, sort of expert, like, bionics guy. Mm -hmm. And they forced him to give them cool bionics. Okay. And I can't remember who they are. There was, like, one Batman Beyond. That's it. One who had like big fucking jumping legs or something like that <laughs> was like, that's kind of shit. One who I think was like super armored maybe and was like, eh, I guess that's okay. Someone else with another kind of like semi practical ability, something probably projectile based. Mm -hmm. And you're like, oh, none of these feel great. And like, this guy's done like some really killer bionic stuff. And the, um, the fourth guy, he had chainsaws implanted on his elbows and knees. Oh! So he goes everywhere. And these things are just always there. Now. That's a choice, isn't it? Uh, and that's what the Crim Gang went for. <laughs> right. Guys, I know what's going to really help us commit crime. <laughs> Chainsaw chainsaws. joints. And everyone's like, whoa, 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 whoa. And he's like, no, seriously, they're going to be great. <laughs> and they're like, but can we not just buy you a chainsaw? <laughs> whoa, 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 stop. And he's like, no, no, no. I'm going to do it. And he had it. And they were trash. They were so bad. <laughs> they, it was so... Like you'd have to be so careful not to just fucking cut yourself yeah. up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like really bad. Um, oh man. Uh, well, there's, there's your new Space Marine chapter. <laughs> <laughs> just fucking chainsaw elbows and knees. I'd hate it. I'd hate them so much. Um, It'd be awful. Apparently he's called Knee Jerk. <laughs> knee Jerk. <laughs> so good. That's such a good um, pun. I feel like they came up with a fucking name. They're like, Knee Jerk is a fun name for like a sort of like bro, cyberpunk crim. Yeah, for some what's kind his, of henchman dickhead. What's his, what's his thing? And someone's like, I got it, everyone. Uh, yeah. Chainsaw knees. And they're like, oh, that's perfect. Amazing. And then someone else like from the boardroom. I'm picturing this is like sort of real 80s businessmen around the table who are brainstorming. Right. Um, brainstorming this. And they're like... Johnson, you got it. Chainsaw knees. <laughs> and then someone else is like, what if? Wait a minute, guys. This is perfect. But what if chainsaw elbows as well? <laughs> and they're just like, oh, my God. My God. <laughs> we'll make millions. <laughs> <laughs> and knee jerk was fucking made. <laughs> um, Sounds amazing. Yeah. Okay, we've got a... Um... Yeah, how does he get dressed? <laughs> he must have to have, like, stripper pants, but all over. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like he's got a stripper t-shirt that he like hooks on from behind. He's got stripper trousers that he velcros onto the back. Oy. He's got like stripper pants, <laughs> so everything can be just like ripped off. <laughs> uh, I hate slash love it. That yeah. is amazing. <laughs> Which actually reminds me. Do you remember Terminator Three? Yeah. Do you remember they do a parody of the scene in Terminator 2 where he walks into the bar and he gets like the biker jacket and he's like, close your booster motorcycle and he, yeah, he, he yeah. and drives off. And in Terminator 3, it's a parody because it's like a stripper bar yeah. and it's like a male stripper on the stage. That means he's gone through the whole of Terminator 3 <laughs> <laughs> with like rip-offable leather pants on. Amazing. I love it. But it never comes up, obviously. But he, but they're there. Oh. If someone grabbed him by the leg, they'd rip his trousers off. Is, does, okay. Right, the Terminator. He, he <laughs> yeah. knows enough to go, he goes back in time. Mm -hmm. And he's like, right, for me to walk around and function as a human, mm -hmm. or like, you know, to have a bit of a disguise, I have to wear clothes. Yes. And he's like, I'm a robot. I know I have to wear clothes. Mm -hmm. um, boom. Sees the guy. Give me your clothes. Mm -hmm. Does he take the underwear? Fuck. 
No, that's inefficient. That's just wasting time. Is it? Like, you know, because he puts like a jacket with a t-shirt mm. underneath, so he knows how to layer clothes. Yeah, but you can see the t-shirt. For sure, but he could have just done the jacket up. Mm. Because he's, in turn, he's wearing the rip-offable strip of pants. But does <laughs> yeah. he have, like, a sparkly strip of thong <laughs> the whole time as well? And just Arnie with, like, a, a minigun. Someone slips, rips the trousers off, and suddenly... He's got the his sparkly fucking thong on. Literary, bedazzled oh, thong. Amazing. <laughs> really changes the tone of that scene. Like, really makes it different. And does he wear everything the other guy's wearing? So has he put on, like, the nipple rings? And <laughs> exactly. How deep does this rabbit hole go? I've yeah. never thought about this before. <laughs> uh, Perfect. Ask any important questions. Because, like, to be honest, if there was a guy coming towards me with a gun mm. and he pulls his trousers down and has a sparkly thong on, the last thing I'm going to think about is you're a robot from the future trying to assassinate <laughs> Maybe, yeah. It would just be it's, sheer confusion. It's buying him precious seconds in combat. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, yeah. Because you bust around the corner and you're like, ah, we got you. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> I just but like, you think that then becomes a tactic. He then recognizes, once he does it once, he's, learn he's a learning machine, right? Oh my God. And he's like, I flashed them. They, they were distracted. It was easier to kill. Just flop his <laughs> dick out. And someone's like, whoa, plow out. Is to walk into the police station, pull his trousers down, and then fucking cut everyone yeah, cause, down. Because it's, it's effective. Yeah, you're not expecting <laughs> a, someone with their dick out to start shooting at you. <laughs> yeah, exactly. My God. My God. Uh, yeah, we're on to something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Jesus, uh, Louise. Louise. Uh, <laughs> Cobb Lars says, this is my first Ben and Tom Warhammer stream. <laughs> <laughs> is it like this every week? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> yeah, pretty not gonna much. Lie. It's not always about the Terminator. Uh, right? <laughs> yeah, but um, <laughs> I'd say tonally, <laughs> yeah. you're probably on to a, a pretty regular thing right now. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> No. Da, da, da. no, 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 <laughs> you know if you've got the bum 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 bum, that is him <laughs> popper, bum 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 bum, <laughs> rips it, ba da da, <laughs> yeah, 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 that's it, oh it. man, um, I'm ready to turn skirmish off on the birdos, <laughs> oh yeah, fuck, uh, so yeah, if you guys have just turned up, I'm so sorry, I'm not, this is, I regret this nothing, is, this is just, <laughs> Can we get a shout out for one sec? Sorry, we got um, we got broccoli, Chiron, Hammerfee, and um, oh, MP Odge as the elite. Um, what do we call it? Skink Squawkdron. The Squawkdron. The Doom oh, Squawkdron. Kind of like that. That's pretty good. Of um, of Hero Burbs. Okay, that's that's very very strong. Uh, Sorry, I can't talk about uh, Robo Dick <laughs> as much right now. Yeah. Gotta, the flashing Terminator must wait for gotta, the Got to move some units around. Um, okay. uh, Clackling, did we do him? Good to see my basic bird boys doing work. Keep up the good work. Thank you, Clackling. Um, Trilt is donated. Uh, you're the best. Oh, no, we already asked, asked that one. Thank you, man. Uh, Cetra the Imperish Imperishable. Says Tom and Ben. I see hey. your lizard adventures go well. Um, I've been busy raising my undead horses and not watched the last couple of streams. Oh no. Have some funds for the lizard funerals. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, there's yeah. a lizard funeral. Thanks man, we're gonna need it. Uh, Mr. Jay Haig has donated and says, Yom, Jen. Jay Haig. Dirty Vod Goblin here. Sneaking into your stream. Dino man's our best man's. Thanks for all the entertainment you've provided over the years, not just in Warhammer 2. Cheers. Oh, thank you very much. Mr. Jay Haig. Uh, the snarkiest donates and says, Scaly boy Tom and Scaly boy Bean. Uh, how are you both? Chiming in after um, good. Ben complained about GW dice. How dare he devoc <laughs> mock the divine majesty that is the squig dice. <laughs> <laughs> I, oh my God, I bought a pack of those dice. And they are so they, they may bounce around and be hard to read <laughs> and uh, really annoying, but... <laughs> Well, oh fuck, they are bad, aren't they? <laughs> so bad, like comically bad. <laughs> oh, thanks, Snarkiest. But I love them. I love them. Um, 
May Daxinormus says, sup losers. Uh, if you're trying to think of new merch ideas, there may be some custom la uh, tabletop models of your own characters. They're surprisingly easy to make these days, and I'm sure people would love them. Um, mm, who do you think you would design yours as? Actually, if someone who actually can do 3D modeling and make a, make a model that we could like 3D print and sculpt, like basically if someone could sculpt it and then we could like mass produce it, <coughs> would you want to give that a go? Something like that. I think that could be cool. Like if we had like a little. We could make like a Brothers Doomborn or or like. Um, yeah, like do our own stupid fucking Warhammer character set of like all our favorite characters. Yeah, we get Toddy, the Doomborn, um, Kral. Um, well, Kral. Well, Le Krell. <laughs> Le Krell. <laughs> to avoid copyright <laughs> infringement. Um, um. Yeah, if anyone knows how to do like. I think we'd have to. Have then we could make a deal with them or something, maybe. Have a chat with Merch Mike as yeah. well to see if how how practical that is. But yeah. That man, that's something I'd really like to sell. Yeah, that would really honestly be like pretty pretty legit. Um. Um. Next, Maddox enormous. Oh, I get it. <laughs> um. Proxage is donated and says, Greetings, Rear Admiral Upper Half Tom and Pigeon Trainer Ben. Scrub the breeding pools and grab your spears. It's elf smashing time. It it's is? Elf smashing time. time. How did the Elite Birdo Brigade do? Uh, I forget they were there. Uh, I kind of forgot they were there, to be honest. <laughs> um, the main Birdo Brigade went in, bombed them, and, and, then, um, and then it was basically over. Wow. These bombs they were, are they, they came up so near effective. See, look, some of them got some kills. Ah. Wow, the Ripper Dactyls, fuck me! Oh my god! <laughs> this is my new best unit! What were they even fighting? I definitely told them to attack something, because I was like, I know they're a melee unit. Empty Modge. Empty Modge, you cold blooded killer. Fuck me, that was good. You must have got into like a couple of regiments. He says, I am number one! You are number one. Uh, well, who was the best chief? It was Hammerfee. MP Modge. <laughs> You give him a, him a funny name. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, hello. I think hello. 20 grand. Yeah, do it. And then we can get a big old... Should we get a mass recruitment. Mass recruit. And make it tomorrow, like, next week's Tom yeah, yeah, yeah. Ben's problem. Because then we can, next week, that's when we can be like, all, all our money shit. <laughs> okay. Um, sure. um, also, fuck, if we get a big stack somewhere, it helps with the invasion here. Um... I think just do it. Like, get, let's get some fucking lords. Let's get some fucking boys. Boom, okay. boom, boom. Should we get the frog? Uh, do you want the, the frag? We haven't got a frog yet. Pow. Frog it up. Uh, ooh, what do you fancy? Fire, high, life, or light? If we go for light, oh, we no. could get the net. No, like, uh, like g give me... What's... What's high magic? Is that just regular lizard elf, magic? Elf magic. Ugh. Let's get fire. Why not? I never really use fire. I don't really use any of these magics, Ben. Which one are you going to use? If I make you use one. Fire. Uh, well, shit. Um, uh, well, we'll see who, who this is going to be. Um, uh, so it'll be Jonez. Jonez. Um... Johnny's, what do you want to be? What do you want to be? People are saying life has heals, fire, high. Life has two heals. Mm. Yeah, that makes sense. Burn everything. Fire is real killy. Fire is best. Oh, stone brick muffin has to go. Oh, Goodbye. Buy stone brick muffin. Uh, fire and light. Get high. Mm. I reckon fire. Let's just fucking right. fire it up. Fire it up. Like, just boom. Fire, fire toes. it up. Where's he gone? Where's this? Oh, he, I know. I can recruit him anywhere I want, right? Um, well, we have to recruit him somewhere where we've actually got like houses that can build people. So, like, actually, let's put him in the capital because we're ready to do the ritual. Yeah, let's do get, that. Like, Just start recruiting, back here. recruiting some ship. Have you uh, killed the orcs? No, I killed the armies that came in, but I haven't like pushed on. Okay, no, that's all right. I was just wondering. Um, uh, so, did you? Oh, there you are. Uh, it's the top guy, isn't it? No, it's Croc score. Oh. 
This guy. Oh. Oh, he's a second gen. Holy shit. Wow. That's amazing. Boop. Holy shit. Also, he's orange. Oh, because he's a fire toad. Color of fire. Uh, should we get some Rifidactyls? Because they're fucking amazing. Yeah. Um, and then we'll wait. Wait on the other stuff. Uh, let's see, have we got some um, magic shit to give him? You've got to change his name to Dollars. Dollars. Uh, Dollars. If you're in. Thanks. You made it. Uh, he's going to have an arcane item. Oh, we don't have any arcane items. What the fuck? You can have tree, tree frog venom, <laughs> apparently. Uh, so, Double O'Connor has donated, and they say, Simon Pegg from Hot Fuzz Tom, and Simon Pegg from Storm of the Dead Ben. <laughs> uh, so, after playing a ton of vampire accounts, I've started to get into the lore of it all. Um, uh -huh. I've just bought the Vlad books. Can oh. you tell us a bit about Conrad? Truly the real Doomborn. Uh, oh, Conrad, he's crazy. He has the he, voices in his head that tell him to do weird shit, right? He's like, yeah, he's the crazy one. Is he the one that got bricked up in a, a thing for a while? It was either he got bricked up or he bricked up a load of people. I think he brick he had a bunch of necromancers because he can't do magic because he's too crazy. So he had a bunch of necromancers do all his magic for him. And I think he bricked a bunch of them up into a wall because they like told him he couldn't do something. And he's like, ah, that's what I like. I'm Conrad. Oh, yeah, shit, I do. Something like that. I do remember something like that. Yeah, I always liked Conrad. The, like, the sort of the real crazy, sketchy brother. Um, yeah, he's just like a liability who's going to just... You never know what he's going to do at any given moment. He's just going to go crazy. But was like a bit of like a stone cold killer. Um, yeah, he's like Caligula esque. Like yeah. Like at least he's got something going on. He's, he's not way more interesting than Manfred. Like oh geez, boring von Karstein. I'd rather hang out with old crazy guy that you're like, hope he doesn't prick me up in a wall <laughs> or just stone cold kill me. Then hello, my name's Manfred. I am good at magic and I, combat. I and like to do magic and, and combat. I raise skeletons. I've raised 57 skeletons so far today. Yesterday, I raised 43 <laughs> skeletons. In total, that's 100 skeletons. That's one unit of skeletons in my army. That's right, I'm Manfred. Like, oh, <laughs> Manfred, please. Oh, oh I hate him. <laughs> <laughs> he, just, he, just, he has nothing interesting just going on. Just thinking about him is upsetting. <laughs> it's all. It's all right. Manfred can't hurt you here. Don't oh worry. God, I'm not, you know, I'd rather he hurts me. <laughs> Might be titillating, but just boring around. Um, <laughs> just it's the Officer Biro of the vampire world. <laughs> he is, but even the Officer Biro has got a bit of charm to his dumb, dumbness. Um, <laughs> it's me, Manfred. I love paperwork. Like, yeah, it isn't that he's like a big, big nerdy guy. It's kind of just, he's good at everything. Like, he's pretty good at everything. He's pretty good at everything and has no weaknesses. And all of his or, stories are just like, he I was, invade the Empire for a bit. I mm. fight some people. Sometimes I... And then everyone gangs up on him and he loses. Oh, I'll be back next time. I'll be back next time. But not That's it, because like all the other vampires have been doing amazingly well and then they kind of get beaten and then they're dead. But Manfred always just fucking comes back. And... Yeah. And it's like, oh, you're not even interested enough to, like, have had some cool resurrection story. Mm. Sorry, we're just talking about Manfred rather than Conrad. <laughs> 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 but, um, but yeah, Conrad's cool. Like all the other. Also, maybe we're being harsh on him because all the other von Karsteins are fucking awesome. Yeah. So I guess by comparison, like it sucks that he's like the boring guy. Because I'm sure <laughs> anytime people talk make jokes about the Avengers, someone's like, "What if you actually read the Hawkeye comic book? You'd find out <laughs> he's a very interesting character." But yeah, but he's like next to Thor and Iron Man. <laughs> yeah, from the films, you're like, well, f well, fuck, he just seems like the really the lame one. I don't like him at all. And so maybe maybe, maybe more going is on. rich, rich Lord. Because I've never very actually exciting. read that much about him because he seems so boring. Yeah, yeah, just like kind of bland. How do I actually get Croak, by the way? Like, I want, I want Croak. Lord Croak. Croak. Oh, move to that, that one. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh. Okay, let's send um whoop de whoop. Whoop de whoop. Off you go. Go find Croak. He's over there somewhere. Um But yeah. Uh so maybe 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 he's good. Who knows? Um but Conrad's Conrad's cool. Is that like a model for Conrad? Yeah. 
He's the one that's way too busy. He's got a cloak that turns into bats. Oh, fuck. And he's fuck. got two oh, okay. swords crossed above his head that blood's dropping out of him. It's dripping going, into ah. his mouth, which is really weird. Because <laughs> yeah. well, both of those swords are really bloody. Yeah. And a bit like, you know, how you would like... Fuck, like... Like white. sharpening your sword, like on a... And he's doing that, and he's like... Ah, la, 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 la. And then the bats are coming off him, and then he's got something on his chest as well. It's just Ugh. like super over-designed. Yeah, fuck, I forgot about much. that one. I was just wondering if there was like an old model. No, there's no old model. Oh, uh, yeah. Hang on. Um, yeah. Yeah. It's gonna auto... Auto the pirate's treasure. Nom. Blammo. Who was best? Oh, Hammerfay again. Best King Chief. Fit. Very good. And Jesus again. Impiods doing that. Impiods. Man, the horses. Who are the horses? Our horses. Uh, Trapo. Trapo. Man, Trapo. Good job. Good job. Oh, I don't know what you grabbed that time. Uh, Brian has donated. Hey, Brian. And they say, Tom and Ben. Brian. Uh, thanks for getting me through another Wednesday. Uh, regarding the shirt thing, what about a metal band style Doomborn shirt with our tour dates locations of failures? <laughs> so legit, this was something that was, something that was loosely, loosely that we spoke about. I think um, Harry and Nina drew up a couple of draft, like a couple of sketches for it. Yeah, doing um, the day. Yeah, like that was honestly something that kind of was loosely in the pile. Um, I can't remember why we didn't do it. I guess we just didn't. We didn't know if it was strong enough. I think it was just like, we were like, well, um, I think we'd only recently been doing the Warhammer streams. And like when it was just Warhammer on my channel, it was like not like a great performing thing. And we were like, well, this isn't a very strong IP. We just do it because we like to talk about Warhammer. So there's no point in making a t-shirt. Um, yeah, we didn't know we were going to keep doing it. And... Because like that, it was partly that, and like we'd spoken roughly about the Toddy design, because we always thought Toddy was funny before mm. we ever did the the Christmas stream. Yeah, and then we're like, "Fuck, actually, this makes sense to do a Toddy T-shirt because this has become this is a meme now, become funny." Um, oh shit! I thought I got two K from that pirate's treasure. Chats told me I got twenty K. We got thirty-five k in the bank. Wait, but it's not—it's not k. Oh no, it's, it's lexapi. We've got thirty-five lexapi. Lexapi. Thirty-five thousand lexapi. Remember, lexapis. people are going to have to remind us <laughs> that it's lexapi. Okay. Um, shit. What do I do? Do I just spend it all immediately? Uh. Okay. I'd say do a round of recruit. Problem is, most of our guys aren't in like. Oh fuck. Okay, try and recruit some stuff. Anything that we can get in like one turn, just so we can get as many more people in as we can right now. Oh man, let's um. Speed, if, speed recruit. If I get, get enough, like, I get a lord like over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, then I can recruit some here. Who do we want? Oh, we want a croco man. We haven't got a croco man, have we? Croco, croco man. Okay, find me a, a name for a croco man. Uh, cool. I can, I could do that. Uh, so the croco man. Uh, can be totally, uh, sure, uh, Double O'Connor, you're in. Because you wanted to talk about Conrad, and we just fucking didn't. We just fucking didn't. He made it. Okay, uh, oh, he can only recruit skinks here. Oh, well. Fuck it, we're getting some skinks in. Um, where else can we get Soros? Oh, it's over here. All right, let's get, um... Oh, shit, are you doing, like, another... Another lord. Another lord. Wow. We can, like, really, really shot, I just, load. We just, um, shot a load early on those... Uh, on those skink heroes. Oh, yeah. I wasn't expecting to have 35,000, though. Like, uh, Bear in mind, once we do the mass recruitment, we are going to be, you know, we need a little buffer. Yeah, that's true. We need a little buffer. It's just I don't have many territories which, where we can recruit. Because um, I never thought I'd be doing this much. Let's just get some swords. Oh, no, uh, what? Uh, I was going to say just get pterodactyls in there. Regular, regular ones. Yeah, just b b bomb birds. <gasps> Special bomb birds. Fire bomb birds. Beautiful. Um, Beautiful. Wow, this territory's worth a fucking thousand bucks already. Okay, and one more lord. 
so um, Vidask has donated as well, and they say, I like you. You're great. This is my favorite dumpster fire to watch, <laughs> and I'll recommend it to all my friends. Hooray! I hope you do. I hope, uh, you know, spread, spread the word. Um, I don't know how else you promote streams other than... No, I don't really know I how guess else. just be good. Be really good. That's so the, people turn up every moment is gold. It? Yeah, always good all the time. That's um, the trick. Jeez, we can't, we can't do that. Mm, can't do um, and Dave Lister 189 has donated, and they say, uh, his further reassurance that this dumpster fire <laughs> that everyone revels in. Wow, those two like go very nicely back together. Back to back. Um, I just come here to listen to two friends chat accurate lore and complain about elves. Wow, that is so niche. basically all, all we've got. We've got that niche covered, though, man. All we've got going on is That's what you want. We... our mutual hatred for elves and our love of Warhammer lore, uh, which is strong. Uh, Michael Murray donates as well, and they say, um, I've gazed beyond time and chaos. Uh, oh, I've gazed beyond time, and chaos has granted me visions of the future vods. Oh. Your empire teeters on the edge of ruin. <laughs> Not a dick remains unripped. Heed my warning. There is still time. You must declare at least five wars immediately. Oh. Just in the sight of Nostradamus. Oh. Uh, well, when that came in, which was like an hour and a half ago, because we're fucking bad at, bad at streams. Um, we've declared two wars, elves and, and orcs. orcs. That's true. So halfway there. Pretty good. Halfway to avoiding doom. Pretty good. You know, I'll take half of doom. That's just om. Yeah, and or between doom. the two of us, yeah, yeah. I'll just take the... <laughs> I'll take the O. <laughs> and what am I going to have then? You can, have the, you can take the D. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, oh, that was good. I like how eager you are. Well, I'll take the. Oh. Hang on, hang on. There's a trap here. <laughs> uh, very good. Uh, nerve gas donates as well, and they say um, I just got called by the wife of the Bulgarian ambassador here in Ireland before the break. Panicked, and I couldn't remember how to meet the stream. I did not want her hearing sexy wives in the background. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? That's the. What else would the ambassador be calling for? Well, Gary, she was ringing up to be like, next week, do you want to watch the Warhammer stream <laughs> together? I'm just calling to see. She heard us tell tell a friend, and so she was like, bam, I know a friend. I'll ring him up and tell him to watch sexy Warhammer. Amazing. See, it's, it's working! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, already. <laughs> okay, I've got loads of units to name, so give me some names. I've got some rip ripper dolls. Okay, cool. Uh, well, um, that can be uh, Dave Lister, uh, 189, um, who said the thing about dumpster fires. Boom. Next one. Uh, sure, Nerve Gas. Um, also, uh, it's the random guys who will be the next person. Uh, they are just bits and they say, Hey, Sir Tom and Sir Ben, here are some bits, if possible. Can you make an army with every unit named after me? and use it just to be a battering ram. That is probably not going to be able to happen, but you've got these guys. You've got these birds They could be a battering ram. Well, I mean, they fly, so... Well, kind of. Well, they're fighty. Uh, Chicken Raptor has donated. Here you go. And they say, I hear there's some spots open to cleanse this world of warmbloods. Uh, I have been waiting to throw my username into the ring. Nice, you're in. You're a bird. Uh, the next one is going to be a Proxage. Uh, Welcome to the party. You're a bird. That's from like a... Next. Uh, that guy Spartacus. You can have as the next one. Um, okay. uh, Jockey23. They say, today was pure gold. Uh, thanks for a great laugh. After a couple of demanding weeks. Uh, good thing it's finally Friday. Perfect. Uh, it's not Friday. The only advantage of college. Keep up the good work. Are you um, confused? Make it, sure you go to your classes. It's Wednesday. It's Wednesday. It's Wednesday. 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 Friday. <laughs> Uh, so, Jockey23, <laughs> you're in. And then uh, the next one is NK Loeb. Um, and they say, talking about bad superheroes, I made a list of my own. Double Eye can give himself eye prescription. <laughs> uh, Timon, uh, he can time travel in real time. <laughs> 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 Booker can judge a book by its cover. <laughs> Intrastain can throw up on command. CV, he can pretend that he can do anything. That's a fucking that's a <laughs> that's great a one. power, though. I like that. CV, I love that. Did you get NK Loban? I did. He's a red-crested boy. Uh, did Nerve Gas come in? Yeah, got him. 
great. Uh, Michael Murray. Cool. You're in. Um, I got a lord to name. Lord? Wow, holy oh, shit. Yes. You want to see how a lord? Uh, fuck it. I'm not going to remember to call Lexipi the money every time, so you're going to have to be a lord instead. I'm sorry. He wants to be the money. Kay. But by next week, I'm going to forget. Morsaurus. I'm definitely going to forget. Uh, Flatopus, you're in. I'm just, I'm just going through, purely at random. Next. Uh, that guy, Spartacus. Done that. Uh, Blue Zarp, the Blue cleaning, cleaning Zarp. product. Okay, next. Uh, Vidask. Cool, and that's it. Oh, man. Perfect. Um, so we've got some fun stuff to do next week. Tic-Tac-Toe can dominate the Elven Empire. Perfect. Um, With bird patrol. We've got help. these birds are trying to chase off the the last little orc army. Nice. And then we've got these all these new armies. Um, which I'm going to do the ritual. So we'll have. Oh fuck! So we can um, go up to yeah the next stage, and they'll all have to fight chaos. That'll be cool. Yeah. So we'll have chaos appearing, and then these random armies will all join up and um, fight them off. What's that blue nonsense? Oh, is oh that that's a quest battle. Oh, is that if, for croak? Um, yeah. If we fight that quest battle, we might get croak. Cool. Or maybe you have to do a few of them. I don't know. But M. Uh, holy shit. Cool. And oh. we're not even bankrupt. Hot Boom. Diggity damn. Amazing. Um, holy shit. Well, thank you to everyone who turned up. Um, you know, much love. Mm. Uh, we're glad that you enjoy the dumpster fire um, that you're watching. Shout out to all the Vodblins. Yeah. You know, those good people. I hope you know what you're getting yourself into. It's dangerous and, in there. And um, thank you to everyone who donated. Uh, that's very kind. Very much appreciated. Yeah, we very much appreciate it. Uh, all the all the likes, the shares, the donos. Yeah, the everyone. Chats. Just being here. Everyone yeah. who uh, did turn up, all of you, you're great. Um, we love doing the stream. We love you all. Thank you. Mwah. See you next week. See you next time. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye.